Hey, we're live. We're going to do a Clarker's Corner swipe up. Nailed it. Hey, we're live. We're going to do a I feel like I nailed that. Yeah, there's two of each here. Hey, are we live? Oh, so one's true blue and one's... Are we live with no warning right now? Did you just shoot it live and yeah, not tell me? Yeah, I literally what said we're I live. What if I said some wild shit? You always do. No. What's the matter if we're live or it's not? It's very different. You didn't even switch this over? You did nothing. You, I didn't open YouTube, idiot. So no, I didn't switch okay. it over. I don't. Which one's what? Bottom one. You think so? Yeah, I'm genius. Told you. I engineered YouTube once. Okay. Whoa. <sighs> I think we're live. What's up, dude? What's up, chat? Let me know if we're live. Looks like we're live. Robert Tina Lutt sent this shirt. Oh, that's and it too. says, suck it. <laughs> that's for all, everybody in chat from last week. All right. Okay, hold on. What are you doing? Grease tagged this in something. I didn't read it. Yeah, it's his collection. He's got some shit bottles in the warehouse C. I told him to get double legal very rare. <laughs> That's actually really funny. We don't have a new shirt sponsor. We're not sponsored by Grunt Style, but Chino did send this to us. I got okay. the, the old Whiskey Tango Foxtrot, a.k.a. WTF. Um, I'm looking for a link. There it is. Justin Jonas said, I won a couple weeks ago on the live, and the guy sent me Joseph Magnus Cigar and a seriously butt stinky rye. Didn't. Okay, so a couple weeks ago. Is it Falconis? We did mystery boxes. No. Nope. Worse? We did mystery boxes. Oh. And I told everybody great shit, right? I said great shit. Is it peerless? So, no. Oh, it's so much worse. So, I, That's two, single two people got Magnus Blend, okay. Cigar Blend. And then two people got some other monster. Well, you're just gonna... I can't remember what the other monster was, but some other monster. I was keeping that for the name, but... Um, I want to include something that you and I recently had talked about not liking. So I sent that Joe Morgan or whatever the hell, the Ed Hardy Rye. Joe Morgan Rye. That there it is. No, oh, we moved it. Moved it. The yeah. heinous shit. Yeah. And I said this is up for everybody to just decide if they like. I just included a little bit of that in each each package. Brian Cusco sent us. He's, he Thanks, said buddy. the proof is in the picture. With the uh, the true blue, uh, what is this corn or true blue cast strength, and then the blue corn bourbon at sixty four. Oh, they're different. Yeah, that's what I just that said. Makes sense. Well, you're not listening to me at all. Well, I'm trying to do something right now. And then he said, "Yippee ki yay, motherfuckers!" How do you know how I feel daily? You just looked at me genuine hearted. Oh, I didn't hit the swipe up thing, and that says swipe up. So now it just looks dumb. Pull them. Yeah, no, that's too hard. So the laziest motherfucker I know. So Brian Cusco, thank you for the samples. You're welcome. Built this empire for you. What'd you say? <laughs> I'm so tired, Chad. That's the end of Justin it. Justin Jonas said, seriously smelled like lemon pine salt covered in poop. Didn't taste as bad. It's heinous smelling rye whiskey. Which is weird because when you and I opened it on the stream, we didn't feel that way about it. Why do you got your book out? For me to write things down. What are you going to write there, Because I'll, event I'll eventually forget what I... I was like, oh, I've got something for this. And if I don't write it down, eventually I'll be like, wait, I had a bottle in mind for oh, I available. See. I see what you're saying. Why are the sleeves on the shirt so tight? Because my arms are fucking huge. Fat. Huge. I've been doing arms every time I lift. Fat. Every, well, that's stretchy. And I'm maxing it. So anyways, both. did you get yours? Like did you try... I'm interested to know if Bove tried. I sent Bove the same rye. I sent everybody that got a package. All four people got a sample of that rye. I just want to hear a little feedback on it. What is that? We're, we're like, that's our private label. You are flexing with that, aren't you? What? The Russell's 13. I was cleaning the table and I set it there. So It's not where it goes. Actually, it is. Nope. Actually, it is. Nope. Yes, it is. Not at all where it goes on this bottle scheme. Yes, it is. Fits perfect. What's up, Linscat? Sure, you don't want me to send some old fashioned from last night, Joe? I'm pretty sure, buddy. Joe, okay, Joe was talking about sending us an old fashioned, but he made the old fashioned. I'm like, please don't send us a, a cocktail you made. 
That's and, so and, and listen, I trust Joe. I get that, but it's going to be rancid by the time he gets here. Right. What, are we keeping ice in it? Like, how are we doing this? So, needless to say. Dan, what was your bench press? When? It, it very important. It very much matters. <laughs> very much Dude. matters. I did 228, 225 for eight. Like, Do you know what? I fucking sometime. fulfilled Zachary Jones' shit for Patreon last month. And I almost didn't. I love him. I'll almost did I'll send him my own shit. No, I checked it off and thought, I shouldn't have sent him anything. <laughs> yeah, but he switches. Sometimes he's your team. Sometimes he's Never. my team. Never. No, he switches a lot. Yeah, he said some dumb shit last time we streamed about me. Well, that's probably because you deserved it. <sighs> What's going on, Dan B? How's it going, buddy? <laughs> Sean's that's missing easy. testicle. Dan, that was, was that kid in high school who thought the villain movie had a point despite the movie being in World War II. Oh, <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> we, I knew it was Aiden on the picture. I told you it was. I literally it. said it's Aiden. I didn't proofread it. <sighs> yeah, I like this uh, shirt a lot, actually. Joe, I know you're fucking around. Um, okay. So tonight, at some point, we're gonna do a collector's corner. Before, we have to get into these because we haven't for twelve weeks, and we've been trying to for twelve weeks. So let's start with the lowest proof first. This uh, is what I like to call a media sample. A media? I'm going to throat punch you <laughs> because my eyes hurt from that burp. <laughs> I am going to punch your throat next time. Chicken tacos. Oh, <laughs> oh like, dude. Oh, oh. Oh. Dude, it's literally it's lingering. hanging here. Turn the overhead on, dude. Uh, Get rid of that shit. Oh, it's literally still here. It's like a shitty fart, <laughs> but it came out of your mouth. <laughs> Felt great. Oh. Very freeing. Gosh. Okay. BTAC so, media samples. That'll never happen. Yeah, I don't think that we're the guys. Will you scroll up a little bit? We missed a super chat, buddy. Nope. Tormentor 3080. Second OF tonight. Second of tonight. Here's to a good live stream. Jan changed the camera angle before you flex, bro. Okay, dude. Second I, super chat. So I wasn't oh, flexing. Was Were well, those for tonight? What? That stuff I get, got in the car? Red label. No, buddy. Those are for the Patreon. Oh, okay. A thousand. Okay. I don't know why you were giving away them. I mean, we literally said it. It's in the drive sheet. It's everywhere. Okay. You're behind. I need you to catch up. I know I'm fast. I was just going to pour you more. <laughs> you pour all of mine in there. This is Blood Oath Packed what? Seven. Seven. It even says the word media sample it's on it. It's already on shelves. I've seen people buying this. I already. know, but we've had the sample, and we keep drinking it, but we don't drink it on camera. We just drank it off camera. I blame you. So. We've done that one on camera. You don't know that. I'm 100% sure oh, you we don't haven't. know that. Oh, we haven't. Th I'm thinking of that yeah. one over there. I was right. That was weird. So, <laughs> so listen. Gosh, give me a favor. Let damn me it. The just you watched me change that. Nope. I didn't. I wonder if when you took it out of the browser, maybe it changed. Yeah, there. probably didn't. Okay, so last night I was streaming on Twitch, right? And I was I was doing this, like just leaning back, and I wasn't flexing, but because of the angle of that camera, one of my biceps looked incredible. And I Joey said, just asked, as lefty, why is your right, right. bigger? And I was like, you know what, dude? I'm not gonna move. Let's just take a picture of this moment, because now that I don't have to be like super mm. strong anymore. I can just, like, look amazing. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, Jamie, it's got to be allergies. The pollen the has been... The fuck did you just say to me? The pollen has been insane. That smells really good. I Definitely. like how it smells. So, I mean, if you guys saw Patreon, me and James were golfing. It went bad. I didn't update people. Um... At one he, point in Sean time, said he was going to. I hit a ball into a field of cottonwood. Oh, good like luck. literally, the entire grass was just white, and I was like, "It's gone, dude. It's just it's gone." That's so. I don't even know what tr trees it comes off of, but our whole yard was cottonwood. covered in it. There, wait, those little white things are called cottonwood, and yeah. the trees called cottonwood. I think so. We ran out of words, huh? <laughs> we ran out of words. Are those the seeds from the tree? Yeah. That's how they, it, it's like dandelions when they, they, they float in the wind no. to carry their spores. No, 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 no. Yeah. I'm not going to have 400,000 trees in my yard now. You know what I'm saying? Well, not, not all of them make it. Literally not even. About, like, none of them make exactly. it. Exactly. Think of an oak tree, like the, the, the spinners. Acorns. 
Yeah, I was thinking maple. The like the little spinners wow. that they have. I'm so much. So those trees. carry them away, but right. like, you don't have a trillion fucking That's trees. That's a good everywhere. point. That's a good point. Um, best drink bourbon to get. <laughs> Why am I reading only inappropriate? I don't know. Or, or comments right now. <sighs> Sean spends more time in the sand than David Hasselhoff. He was a he was a beach guy. Well, uh, the ones that save people. Baywatch. Life guy. Life guy. That was quick. Both times somebody down already. <gasps> <laughs> okay. I don't know Can what Bo's doing. time that out, Bo? I will take your wrench away right fucking now. Nope. Why Damn. did you time out Norm, Norm for saying cheers, cheers boys? <laughs> Bo? The thin ice. We do. What do you fuck didn't think that do is? Do you hear that? Yeah, what is that? You want to take a knife you with got you? got a knife? I'm gonna open the door to you, Okay. That was terrifying. Who that the, was terrifying. Who was it? Who is it? The trash can going down the driveway sounds like somebody's trying to murder us. Apparently, uh, I think it's Ricky pulling a trash can down the driveway. What? Sorry. Now you got me. No, Dan. Pretty much normal. Nay hey, Russell. What up, junkies? Currently sipping on Wild Turkey 13-year limited edition. Hope y'all have some great pours lined up. It's okay. We're not drinking that tonight. It's okay, though. We're not drink- That's Wild Turkey 13-year. That's not that. That's Russell's. Oh, that's what that's I was thinking. That's turkey. I know you were. Same thing, though. Because you turned around and looked at it. Same thing, though. 13-year turkey? Not the same. Different Different Rick houses. Same thing. Different houses same built thing. by Rick. Rick's houses. Is this on low? It seems way behind. What four games have you guys tried? We're going to try the... Most of them. Kelvin Collaboration 3. We've tried a lot from like 7 or 8 up, I feel like. Like 6 up, I feel. 6 We've up? We've had all. Okay. The Ruby... Is that what this is? Yeah, Ruby Rye Springs. I like that one a lot. You def- um, I don't know because we went to play Fortnite tonight at like 7 and neither of us knew that there was a huge update. So now me and him have to do the updates we can play tomorrow. Uh, Zachary Jones wants to do a shout out. His Will pet- you give my pet beta fish a shout out? No. <laughs> no, I won't. Put another beta fish in there. See what happens to it. Okay, so anyways. Oh, Aiden. I love the Sagamore Calvados, dude. It's so good. Okay, don't say behind my neck, fat Trevor. We're not doing this already. We're not. We're fucking not. You didn't read another super chat. You're what? You're, Sean's off his game tonight. Have you tried the single barrel select from Maker's Mark blended by Willie? Mm, motherfucker. <laughs> Got through the first name. You did. You did. Oh, man. Oh, we got another heartburn night. This will be fun. Oh, my gosh. I can just hear you fucking bitch the whole time. Get ahead of me. Why? Probably why, a second. Why is this happening? Mean? I don't know why this is happening. So what is Pack 7 What's the, what are the dates on They're all 101 proof. I know that. This is like a triple finish or some shit. Okay. No, this is the... Is this the rum cast finish one? I don't know. It's really sweet. It is. It's super sweet. Um, I can believe it's rum. Let's see. Blood Oath Pact 7. A little drying. At 100... No, 98 proof, sorry. It's a blend of 14-year extra age rye bourbon, an 8-year rye bourbon, another 8-year rye bourbon finished in Sauternes wine cast from the Bordeaux region of France. 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 You know what I mean? So. No. That's, it's wine finish. I have a little salter. Salt and knife in there. White wine. Okay. Thought all. Uh, yeah, that's what it is. 98.6. You're right. <laughs> I'm not doing Prilosec for a few months. I'm not getting on like a fucking over the counter shit. Um, um, I think Pack 6 is better too. Blood Oath Pack 13 sounds average. That's not out yet. And then he said Pack 7. Yeah, I've been behaving for like four days, and it hasn't gone away, so. 
What's your diet like? Um, I just assume it's like a fucking grizzly bear attacking a trash can. Yeah, but I only pick out the meat, basically. <laughs> so, like, today I had ham and cheese and eggs and bacon. And then yesterday I had, like, when I say ham and cheese, I literally just had slices of ham and slices of cheese. Too much cholesterol, your gallbladder's going out? No, there I don't go. think that's it. Sipping on Kessler single barrel select bottled in bong water, Edward Fulmer said. <laughs> What's up, Berman? How are you doing, Trev? I read most of that. Aiden just wanted to say I started another channel meme, and I'm very proud of my efforts. Keep going with the names, lads, especially you. That's a good name. You did a good job with that one. Dan is on the seafood diet. He sees food. He eats it. I don't. I've literally not even had. I've had way too few calories today, if I'm being completely honest. Um, yeah, you should eat something green once in a while. I had asparagus yesterday. Oh. Ugh. I like kale chips a lot. A little oh, tiny gosh. bit of olive oil and then a little bit of salt. A little, little pink Himalayan salt. It's a lot sweeter. This is so sweet, man. This blood oil. No, is. Himalayan salt is sweeter. The pink salt. Yeah, it's also just more delicious. Fatty. So. Bourbon Wrench said, been getting nasty war zone wins without you lady. later. Better get me back on the squad. That's true. It's not been Dan doesn't get wins. Squad. Not for the squad. The squad's not been. We actually kind of have an opening because James is never around anymore. So what is he doing with his life? Um, literally consuming beers every day of the week with other human beings. Sounds fun. <sighs> it sounds like a lot of interaction to me. You know what I mean? <laughs> Seems like I gotta care about some people. <laughs> this shirt is from Chino. <laughs> Chino. But it's also Lutz. from. Uh, I think he got it from Grunt Style. Yes. Away. Thank you, buddy. Chino for doing that. Uh, have you guys thought about Toast and Nula pick? I've thought about Tried. a lot of picks. Actually been trying. I have messaged people. Yep. But it was something that they were waiting on. I've messaged two people, to be exact. I thought that was supposed to be Two very up. important people in the ish. process. What? I thought that's coming up-ish. I don't that, know. That timeline that we were told originally. I don't have a date. I haven't, I haven't re-bothered. Okay. Um, this is still a little bit nutty, this Blood Oath is. Just what? a hint. Yeah. That's a hint. It's like behind the wine finish or something, though. You know what I mean? A little bit. Yeah, I, just a little. Oddly enough, like, I don't know why 98 proof is super drying, but, like, halfway through, it just, all the moisture is going out of my mouth. I don't like it that much. Eric, I like, I am just worried about reading names now all of a sudden. Eric said, just found you guys today. Looking great. Probably watched Thanks, a video man. that a lot of people Appreciate hate. <laughs> A lot of people hate it, but a lot of people like it. So, it's almost got 10,000 likes on it. Yeah. The, How many thumbs down? Huh? How many thumbs down? Not very many. Oh, okay. Um, Like 800, 700, 900 range. Somewhere it's there. gone up, I bet. No, like that was like today or yesterday or something like that. Things have changed. Things have not changed. You know, in the last 48 hours, how many views have been on that video? Yes, I do. Okay. And not everybody that watches it downvotes it. It seems like it. Everyone that comments no, no, definitely just has. just reading the wrong comments. I just block those people now. I don't even, I literally immediately just yeah, block read people. Them. I read them. Mash Bill. Hello, I'm your host, the Mash Bill. They say, don't have the goat on the first show, but why not? Dan Shook is my first guest on the Whiskey Douchebag. To you. Yeah, I mean, he called me the goat. So realistically, it was like a... Greatest of all time. Yeah, he, it was like a... Compliment. Zachary, I can't imagine why I'm paranoid to read people's names at this point in time. You guys... Um, you all did it. A musical? I actually never heard you guys mention bands. What are your jams? I mean, usually we... talked we, about rappers before. I like... I uh, listen to about everything. Same. So on my presets, I got rock. I've got... I guess you'd call it like modern hip hop jams and uh, country. Hurt my fucking chest. What? What? That that's your heart trying to pump. It's not doing uh, right. Uh, it's pumping acid reflux up my esophagus right now. Not what that does. Um, what are you looking at? I'm trying to look at how many downvotes that video has, just to see. I'm I'm interested. Are you kidding me? You um, could just ask chat to go do that. Yeah, but we're told here. Us. You know, we're here. Um, Laptop's plugged in. Is it? Yeah. I can see the symbol. What's your favorite protein powder? Ooh. On. Um, yeah. 
They're uh, they're pretty solid. I used to like the Monster stuff. They had that like cookies and cream. Mm. It was delicious. Stream stuttering. Ugh. We're doing that, huh? It's your internet. I doubt it. I'm sure your shit is uploading something at a rate of four million fucking fingers. Let me guess. The manager with the task. Hanging her out. Fortnite download? I'm not downloading Fortnite. Holden's not here, so he's not either. Oh. OBS. Yeah, it's just OBS. Yeah, I don't have anything uploading. Let me see. Let me check it. It's fine now. Okay. Ricky, did you uh, download everything as soon as you got home or something? It's like, I'm not even on the Wi-Fi. You are on the Wi-Fi. I'm not. Oh, your phone's not? It shouldn't be. Oh, My laptop your laptop's is, named, you dummy. Your laptop's named Arrow. I'm like, well, something's fucking eating right yeah, now. Yeah, look. Arrow. It's the model of the laptop. I know, but that's the name of it, too, apparently. You thought my phone's name was Arrow? No, I didn't. I thought there was a device on my network called Arrow. There is? That, and I didn't know that it was the laptop. Hey, hey, Ron Atkins. Good evening, boys. From Birch Run, hey. Wanting to crack open a new bottle night, bullet 12-year, rye, or each tail a small batch. Any help, each tailor immediately. Are you inside or outside? Because if I was outside, I'd probably go with that bullet 12 because it's real crushable. It is, isn't it 90 proof? Yeah, it's something really low, and it's super sweet, and it's super... Um, 95.5. Gentle. Yeah. Like, it's not really rye spicy, which is... One of the things that makes it so amazing. David Arubio. What up, junkies? Didn't catch Thursday stream. Congratulations. Yeah. It was our Patreon-only nice, stream. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, Thursday we did our Patreon giveaway for hitting 1,000 patrons. And we had, like, a live stream and did it for, uh, like, a Patreon-only stream. It, was, it turned out great. We gave away a lot of stuff, 30 things, I think, to be exact, between us and, like, all the channel partners and sponsors. So it was great. Um, one of our sponsors Ooh. was Alec Bradley. Yeah. And... They also happen to be the live stream sponsor for this evening. Yeah, so, we'll be smoking some Alec Bradley's later tonight. We will. I'm going to be I'm smoking a, a Nika Puro Lancero, little H Town a edition. Cigar Club, that was the, the exclusive this month. It was. Kintsugi, so. And so thank you to Alec Bradley for working with the channel, as always. Literally one of oh, our longest guys. standing sponsors. Great yeah. people. I saw Alec in chat a little earlier. I don't know if he's still here or not. But I was just going to read the old Power Keeper. Um. That's why it's stuck. Ivan was like, where can I get some Kintsugis at? And I was like, bro, here's a site. And I gave him a site. And he's like, holy shit. That's I? Yeah. yeah. And they're not that expensive on nope. there. And they have amazing customer yeah. service. Yeah, but they do. The Kintsugi, we talked about this, I think it was last week or two weeks ago. But the Kintsugi just won one of the best sticks under 10 bucks. And I think the Project 40 Maduro also belongs on that list. Personally. Zachary, if your name came up, respin. It is a little suspect, dude. It is. Ricky said that she, I'm welcome. Yeah, for taking all the trash. But Power Keeper said, it's after a very time. stressful week and a half of moving, congratulations, or maybe, I don't know, maybe hope it's good circumstance you're moving. Finally had my own man cave to drink and smoke my Sounds cigars like in. Look at the size of that fucking ant. Oh, that's sad. Oh. That's mean. <clears throat> hey, kill the animals out here. That's mean. What's up? Cigar Club? Heading there by end of stream. Dude, I want to man cave. Cigar Club was also one of the sponsors, and they're here right now, too. So thank you guys both to sponsoring the Patron Cigar, taking care of our hey. community, taking care of us, everything. You guys are amazing. Thinking about giving an Alec Bradley gift package to my son. Thanks for the idea, David Little said. That's awesome, man. Oh, listen, there's so many hitters in the lineup at this point, it's absolutely ridiculous. Yeah. I was talking to Alec the other day about certain cigars that they make. He said those cigars are all cigars that were, like, we're running out of stock of. And I texted him, I said... You should probably just make a lot worse cigars, and then people won't buy them anymore. So. Don't do that. That's terrible business advice. Don't listen to Dave. They'd have stock. You know what I mean? Supply and demand. I'm just figuring it out for them. Ryan Angle. And Gel. And Gel. Hey, what's up? Oh, oh, there was a, cr a crease. Look there's a makes hard it look crease. Like an M. There's a hard crease right there. I thought it was a Modem Dysfunctional <laughs> Junkies doing today. Yep. How? Good. So How? far, so good. Dan's tired. It's been a good day. Who isn't? Be an adult. It's been a good day. Don't ask if Sean has duct tape for my mouth. I am a responsible 
grown man right now. I haven't, I haven't been irresponsible once yet. So Yeah, I like how you throw a yet on there. Well, I assume at some point in the stream. Now, I'm going to drink this four gate. Spending my eighth anniversary with my beautiful bride, watching our favorite Tuesday night show. Give me an AB pairing for that old Carter batch eight. Uh, blind faith. Go high proof. Uh, that's not even a remotely close. There's not even a second to that. There's no second place to that pairing. Oh. Blind faith with an old Carter. That okay, was I one. was. I thought you were just yelling at me like that's a terrible pairing. I was like, I, I thought it would be good. Joey said Cigar Club was wondering how to get set up with Into the AM. I don't think you're telling the truth, Joey. Mm. You are a liar. Into the AM was one of the sponsors for the patron giveaway, too. So was Scotch Malt Whiskey Size. So was Justin's. There's a lot. So was New, New Air. Air. So was uh, Kentucky Bourbon Art, Barrel Art. Yeah. Can you uh, rinse that for me? Yeah. Um, these are from... Do uh, you want me to rinse it how I rinse uh, it? Grunt style. There you go. Just... W- Water? I've got liquid IV in mine. Don't you fucking dare. That's how I did it. Are you serious? Yeah, the, You're it's a fucking my glass, monster. bro. I backwashed into this already. So I assume so. Yeah. <sighs> Code man has a really important question. Who buys the whiskey? And do any of you get mad when one drinks too much of your Sean's favorite? Always mad. Yes. Also, just letting you know that I love your channel. Thanks for getting me in the whiskey. You're hey, welcome. Thanks for being here, buddy. Um... I don't drink the good whiskey without Sean. There are just pictures of you bottle chugging Jorpsy Stag. Right, mine. Ours. The one I found. No, no, no. That the one mine. I found. I paid for it, though. But I found it. Yeah, okay. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm just taking my cut. Not really. Finder's fee. Um, we generally don't drink, like, middle shelf shit if the other person's not here. Or, like, we had, like, a dusty turkey. Sean drinks King of Kentucky when I'm not here. Other once, than that. Once ever. Um... No. What's funny is there's a guy named Codeman on Twitch that streams, um, like, uh, fucking, what do I want to say, casino games, like slots and shit. Oh. Okay. Like high stakes, though. Jeez, oh, like $50,000 buys on stuff. What? Oh, yeah. Jeez, oh, <laughs> My gosh. Yep. Um, Forgate Kevin collaboration number three is what this is. Kelvin, Kelvin. sorry. I was like, who the hell's Kevin? And it smells amazing. We liked number one a lot. Number two, we were kind of eh. Or am I getting that backwards? I don't remember. I know we liked one of, one of them a lot, and okay. then we're lukewarm on the other. Okay. That smells fantastic. Oh. Drew Fierstenberger said, show the boys some love. Hit that thumbs up. Please do that. While you're chilling, there's 500 and change you in here. There's oh. less than 200 likes. So maybe we can try to get to around 300 likes. That would be very considerate yeah. of you guys. That's true, Aiden. That really sucks. That's miserable. Power just went out. 100 degrees. Laundry was going. Hopefully it was the dryer. Dude, this Forgate smells incredible. Um, it's 120. One of them was like proof. split stave, wasn't it? The first Kelvin? Yeah. Was that the Kelvin that was split stave? I thought I so. thought that was named something different. Oh, I don't remember. I thought it was. This thick. is Kentucky Straight Bourbon finished in PX Sherry and Rum Cast. That's where I got the rum idea uh, from. What were the first two? If we got divorced and had to split the bottles, what are we fighting for the most? I just get them all. I'm taking all the high west door picks. I just get them all. Out of spite. I inject heroin into Sean's veins. <laughs> I tell the court to drug test him because it was his fault the falling out was. Oh, okay. They then drug test and they find out he's a heroin addict almost near death. It'll be on video. They allow me, because he's an addict, to have all of the whiskey. So. Solid. This I is mean, my plan. That's premeditated. Solid now. on Sons of Anarchy. Can't do that. It's premeditated. He did that to his girlfriend to get his kids. Old Forester, nineteen fifteen. Is it worth doing? No, uh, I don't think so. We we just weren't big fans of it. I know a lot of people really enjoy it. Justin said, "Dan told me not to do it, so I did it." So far, I think he's wrong. Mm-hmm. Okay, here's the problem. I think that nineteen ten is too good, and nineteen twenty is too good. That nineteen fifteen is just not better than either of them. That's what I think. Cognac and rum finish was. Uh, collaboration oh and this is sherry and rum interesting okay (laughs) i'm addicted to meth heroin won't do shit to me yeah oh burn beginning said that split stave was not a kelvin all right i'm just remembering misremembering so dumb 240 from m10 no what would you pay 240 with tax for m10 no no not even i wouldn't pay over like 130 plus tax oddly specific i'd do 150 well because i think what first bottle (sighs) okay first one 
If we can get to 400 likes, can Dan break something of Sean's? Won't break your face. Like his neck, if he ever burps like that again. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. Oh, this is so sweet. Zachary Jones tagged Ricky and said that he misses the TikToks. Ricky got some shit on her phone that she puts up. Our channel's going down. What? Oh, of course. <laughs> what were the finishes on these? It's me running around naked in public. What'd you say? What's the finish Sherry on Sherry rum. Okay. What's, it reminds me of Dovetail, how sweet it is, though. Yeah, but it's not... It's like a... Mm -hmm. I don't, but it doesn't have the same dickleness to it. Yeah, but it's like uh, gushers, you know what I'm talking about? Open a nice package of gushers and you smell. And they gush. You know what I mean? Nope. Let them gush, dude. It does. It's really fruity. Oh, it's hot. Pussy. It's a little warm. Heartburn. Um, about 124 proof. Yep, that's really good. Oh, wow, it is almost 124 room. Ricky said she can't follow Dan. Why can't she? Why can't you follow me around? It. She doesn't love me anymore, Maureen dude. said, just don't break Sean. See? <sighs> just his neck or his throat, whatever I told you. I was going to punch earlier. Uh, did I try the Lafroy? It's open, which means I tried it, but I don't recall if I loved it or didn't love it. <laughs> Gary Francis just got here. Sure, nice to see Sean drinking from a glass. Must be his bottle. Because I was just... That one stream, I just drinking everything out of the bottle. Just why it was up, freaking junkies. What's going on, buddy? Thank you guys for the super chats. I take back no. the super chat. That Joe Morgan rye is heinous. But <laughs> yeah, it's <laughs> not good. So, he Our, said earlier it smelled like lemon juice with WD-40 sprayed into it. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, that's fair. It's chemically. Uh, we scored negative two in a scramble with three people. I bad. was at Klein's. That's bad. I got home at three o'clock in the morning. Got up at oh, seven we got to excuses. Go golf. Oh wow! James apparently was hungover. Shocking. The other guy rolls in, and goes, "Anyone else hungover?" I was like, "Yeah." We got excuses for a competition nobody saw. Yeah, you guys think I'm bad? At least you all watched the competition. I lost, right? So like, I'm pleading my case to the people who Ours saw. This is a fundraiser. There are no winners or losers. Oh, shut the hell up, dude! We're there for the oh, children. Shut up! That's the dumbest shout yeah, I've ever heard in my life. One good. The winners um, shot uh, fifteen hundred. What? What are you I'm, looking at? Will you scroll up? Alex said something. He was drinking something. He tagged us in. It's lower than that. It's for sure lower than that. I'm drinking Woodford Batch Roof. I don't know how in Sean didn't miss this. Or Sean didn't guess this. Me neither. I don't know how he didn't guess that either. Man, if he would have, he would have been in round two with me. That would have been fun. Negative two. Y'all knew what it meant, Alec. <laughs> Yeah, that's how you know Sean's a golfer. He says negative two was his score. <sighs> Even I know it's we two shot, under. Uh, two under par. Jeez, oh beans, dude. I told you this number earlier. What's par? What? What's 72. Par? Oh, there you go. I guessed it earlier. You said that's par. I said I know. I know par on 18. Do we know? I'm used to the seeing that number without my handicap. Can't read that name. Sean, don't let this malt manatee push you around. Okay. Don't. Okay. We found out. I was asking. Okay. You were asking. Good story so far. Well, I'm trying to award this carefully. Oh, so somebody said if we got married <laughs> or something, what would happen or something like that? And I said, Sean's in the, in the universe if we were lovers. Yeah. Or we like dudes instead of chicks. All right. Yeah. I said Sean would be a twink. He, like, fits the profile. And okay. I said, I fit the profile of a bear, but I don't have any hair. <laughs> so I was like, You're what the fat. hell? Well, yeah, like, but there's a name for everybody, right? You're manatee, So I'm huh? like, what's a large gay dude without hair? And somebody was like, somebody called me a hippo. I'm like, that's fucking yeah. rude. But then CJ said that a manatee is the term for a bear without, a large dude without hair. Hey, we're in uh, around the Tri-Cities of Michigan. 70... We ain't, we ain't got U.S. Open courses around where we're at. There is one in the state. Let me tell you what. We, we ain't playing at those. I like that four gate a lot. Yeah. I picked the four gate over the blood oath. A thousand percent. That being said, it's twice as much. Two hundred percent. I think that four gate, though, is um, more complex, has more depth. It, I don't know if it's the proof. It doesn't have the nuttiness. I like the base whiskey that's in there. You know what I'm saying? Whereas I think I like the base whiskey here less. Man, that's spicy grapes, man. I like that a lot. I, I think it is. It's like the the gusher thing. It's really like sugary, fruity. Yeah. Um, 
But yeah. And that is real spicy oak. LJ said, hit the yep. like button so they'll stop discussing sizes and hairiness of, of gay men. Fair. Um, you sampled a three chord 12 year. Is it a dickle three chord or is it a non? I guess they do a non dickle three chord. Hopefully we haven't had one of those. That one. We haven't had one of those yet. We don't like dickle a whole lot. So. Um, oh. All right. Oh, I don't have any actual water. I was going to say, I bet a couple drops of True water. True Blood is so good. That show was fantastic. Have you ever watched that show? Which one? Vampire that? show on uh, HBO? No. Nope. Well, it ended years ago. It, dude, it's why everybody used to say, Suki. Hey, Suki. Because the vampire, they're all Southern. And her name was Suki. And he would always be like, Suki. <laughs> Just like that. That's a spot on impression. I can guarantee that. Oh, I'm so close. All right. So. Now, we're going to try these. The it's a dickle. The 15 year three quarter is not dickle. Is that the cool label? Like, it's a completely different label. The vampires do not sparkle. But the longer they live, the stronger they get. Like most vampires. And one of the vampires is like a child, and he's just a straight badass. Spoiler <laughs> alert, dies to the sun. All right. Lots, Lots of boobs. Very I'm true. in. You've, you've seen... Like pictures from the show, like the Probably. like the cast and everything. Yeah. Actually, fantastic vampire show. So, you already threw the box away. Cusco Tennessee's. Yeah, we. I already said it like three times. Okay, Cusco reminds me of that movie, the Disney one, where the guy turns into the llama. Wow, Emperor's New Groove. Yep, that's the one. All right, so this is... Biggest thank you for sending bro. samples, buddy. This is True Blue Cast Rank, 54.7%. True Blue Cast Rank. This is Texas Blue Corn. Okay. If you're doing spot-on impressions... Turkey? Don't we have a case of water in here? Yeah, it's empty. So you just sit out here and drink water. I bought the water, so if it makes you feel Instead better. Instead of just walking your happy ass in your house. 1,000%. <laughs> Filling up your goddamn no, water. No, I would literally thing. pour the bottles into that. I swear to God. 1,000%. I went to Costco and bought those myself. I spent my own $2 on that pack of water, and I drank almost all of it, I think. Rogue from X-Men is a main girl. You see her boobs every other episode. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, true. I'm in. There's a lot she of nudity. Hideous. There was a lot of nudity in True Blood. I should have started that. No right. dongles, though. No, you can't show that. Mm, there might be one dongle. I don't know if you can show that. Why? If you can show everything on a chick, you can show everything on a dude. Including they don't, they don't show buttholes. vaginas. Some places they do. Is it softcore if they just show it? Yeah. Nah. Not in today's society. You can go on Instagram and damn near see one now. <laughs> Damn near. Okay. Both said this Joe Morgan Rice smells like James's undies after Monday's softball. Probably. I don't doubt it. Oh, I would. Yep. Just mentally prepare yourself for that. Just mentally. Oh. I wasn't prepared. I wasn't. I heard you say it and I wasn't. I wasn't. We just got a Costco in town, Chris. Yeah, that's Texas. You guys rocking the new lens? No. Old, you know what? Actually, old lens. Yeah, that is the 24 That's the old lens. Sure. Dan steals the good one for his Twitch you, streaming. You know what? Here's the good news. There's a button. They twist. They pop off. It's interesting. Yeah. I wasn't going to do it, though. Oh. Why did I do it again? We just went to Costco <laughs> and checked out, and she goes, hold up. Need to see your card. Okay. She goes, you're flagged in my system. Yeah, you thieves. For spending a lot of money. Would you like to upgrade oh, yeah. your subscription? They do that to everybody. Fuck it. You know what? It was they, half off. They or did. like three quarters off. Oh, they got you 25 too, 25 huh? bucks. They got Ricky too. Yeah. Yeah, you, they thieved you and my wife. Yeah. And you know what Ricky said? It'll pay off. That's what she said to me. Why It'll pay Skype itself him. off. Beep, beep, Thank beep, you, T-Shep. You get that your money back. That will literally cover a case of water. You get your money back if you don't like cover so much or spend so much. No. Here's the thing they tell yeah. you. Yeah, but they know you're going to spend more than that. Yeah. They're like, you get 10% back on your groceries. I'm like, we have to spend $42,000 to pay for the card now. No. We do. $42,000. I don't think you're good at me. Annual salary. Pay for the Costco card. I don't think. I don't that's, that's what they told me. I don't know. That was the executive membership, I bet. We got one, too. It's fan Now, it did get us $1,000 off on a car for Ricky. Yeah. Because for some reason, they're just Costco gives away money. Yeah. She was like, if you check into a hotel, ask if they do Costco discounts. That's yeah, weird. It's very weird. 
And they change them. So Costco, like, might not be doing it, but then, like, they might later. Yeah. So when so I do weird. things, do you do a, a Schmau discount? No. All right. They do a lot of stuff. You're talking, like, Verizon or something? Schmau, Schmau, Schmau. I know, but, like, where they do, are like, you a lot, that? like, uh, hotels and stuff. Oh, really? Rental cars. Oh, okay. You can do a lot. Guess you're not old enough to see. Oh, have you guys done a blind of all your BJ picks? It's so funny you say that because Grant Hartwig sent me a message the other day. It's a picture of all of our picks. He said, tell me what order they come in. I'm blinding them. So I told him. Does he have them all? All of them except the bullet at the point. Time oh, which well, did. that would be first. Um, I said. New gold, riff. I said golden. You're an idiot. I said golden tickets first. Easily, without a doubt. Not even Might. close. And then I said um, <laughs> probably Sagamore or Knob Creek next. I put the new riff last, tie with baking bread. Those were the wow. last places. I really forgot you don't like that new riff. It's it's okay. You're so bitch. Anyways, it's yeah. fine. So Everyone anyways. emails, yeah, I love this big so much. So yeah, it's so good. The, uh, oh, that's great. I was right. Golden ticket won. Yeah. You know what came in second? New riff? Mm-hmm. Of course. It's a good fucking pick. He put Sagamore last. Now, that is the only rye. So that is going to be weird in that, in that flight. But I think we should do that as a video, like a Thursday. We blind all our picks. I got the bullet tonight, and I'm drinking it now. Straight money. Yeah. Power Keeper, which you don't Just even mention. What's that mean? Put this into everyone's mind when you're buying our new bullet picks, Team Dan versus Team Sean. Dan thought our new riff was bad. Yeah. Yep. Keep that in mind. It's good. Keep it in mind. And that folks at home, is why my bullet pick will do better. And my stickers, fire. Oh. Sean's over here asking me for illustrators. I'm not helping you. I know you won't. I'm but not helping. You, you. I already helped you. I told you. You didn't even tell me the format. I told you, be aggressive. That's what I told you. That's okay. helpful. That's, That's helpful. fine. Because when you do just a Team Sean sticker and I do my murdering sticker. Okay. You're going to be like, shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, how do we buy your picks? Patreon.com slash bourbon junkies. Okay. Gino actually just put a link in thing. We should in a chat right there, but we should have a Starlight pick this month. Um, a Starlight pick, I think maybe next month, a uh, finished one the month this month or the month, month after. Finishes next. Oh second. no, no, I think the regular one's supposed to be this so one. I just said. Oh. Thanks for being a part of our conversation. Fuck you. I said it. You ignored me. Yeah. Remember when we started the stream and you said, Wow, you're not even listening. Ah, uh, all right. <laughs> Let me uh make Sticker. Sticker. I was just kind of hoping you'd do it yourself. It's Aggressive. Paint. You got like, <laughs> like you drew lines on it. Yep. If I were you, I'd hire DC. But, or Will. Either one. DC made some good shit for the Matt Madness stuff. Like, really good shit. Now, I am... Actually, I actually haven't hired oh. anybody... Keith Casey Well dropped off a custom what? ashtray at Saginaw. What? See an ale for you guys. Thank you for all you do. What? Uh, cool. I Thank will you. drive I'm... my ass over there just to get that. No, do you just... have pictures of it? We just make Sean pick it up. Oh, no. Are you bleeding? Yeah. Mosquito must have got me. Sean picked a AIDS scab he's got on his leg. I think Mosquito got me in your fucking... Don't... I thought you were just trying to rub it on me. I'm Look like, that, hey, jeez. You got me good. Wow. That looks like Sean just stabbed himself in the leg. A lot of people want greasy going on our picks. I don't know. I forgot about a conversation I had earlier that I want to talk to you about. We didn't have time to talk about it before this. Want to talk about it now? Sure. JD? Careful on that. Careful. <laughs> well, still wasn't ready, were you? Because I wasn't either. I've smoked Dude, it four okay. times. A lot of caramel. Why do you have mine? That's mine. Because I'm not going to taint another glass with it. Don't. That's the same glass I poured everything in so far. Okay, I guess I'll it's seventy percent. Like it'll be fine. You know what I mean. So, anyways, <laughs> Bo, Bo, I just wanted you to try it, dude. Bo, I told Bo, I go, listen, I sent you something absolutely fantastic. It is. I also sent you something that you can make your own decision on, and and then I go, <laughs> and he goes, you sent me Malort. I go, I promise it's not Malort. I don't know if it's worse though. I don't think it's worse. It doesn't stick around Spaghetti like spaghetti and boots. But uh, you listed picks and didn't mention the KC pick. I didn't? Nope. I, yeah, I said the KC or the nope. Sagamore would be second or third. No, you didn't. Yes, it did. No, nope, never happened. Um, this is, so if you get a, a biscuit from KFC, you cover it in honey, and then you throw a little mesquite sauce on okay, there. Okay, I was going to say you're missing like the weird, charry. Yeah. Okay. 
Like a mesquite barbecue. Rugged Gemma said, sorry I'm late, but I stuck in a bottle of Redwood Empire Lost Monitor. It's good shit. I'm not a fan of that. Spurgu's answering questions about the tiers and stuff like that right now in chat if people have questions about that. So is both. Okay. So, yeah. If you join Patreon, that's where the picks come through right now. Damn, um, it's quad is not big to my waist. It literally is the same size. So, anyways. No, it's not. Are um, you fucking Barry Sanders? Yes. I think not. I think that's one of the names people call me. They usually put of whiskey at the end. So, the Tom Brady of whiskey. Okay. The Michael Jordan of whiskey. You know, things like that. Riley Carlo. Have you guys started looking for Russell 13 yet? Not sure when it hits the shelves, but I'm sure it won't last long when it does. Can you see it? Sick, we have not. Found one. Um, okay. That's we okay. really... We, you know what I would like to do in the new building? That would be really cool to have our <laughs> live stream set up. Yeah. Have one of those systems where we have a few cameras and then it can like focus on whoever's talking or whoever's doing dumb shit like that. Stuff like that. What? Like when you get a whiff of something rough. You know what I mean? Okay, so now take everything that I said. Golden Ticket was our mo- one of our most recent picks that we've done. Yeah. Uh, that, that honey-covered mesquite biscuit. Yeah. Right? And, and imagine someone threw it up into a glass and that stomach acid's in there. And that's what this tastes like. No, I get so... Okay, if I put my nose at the top of the glass, I get so much honey. Mm-hmm. It's so much better up there than it is down below. Have you tried it yet? No. Try it. I'm a little nervous. Yeah. Uh, big shout out from the Marines at Quantico. Vir- is that Virginia? VA? Does that feel right? Mm. Yeah. Plenty of bourbon junks here. Hey. Hey, cheers, gentlemen. Thanks for all that you guys do. I'd, the face isn't for you. The face is... Oh, it's like rotten. I told you it's that stomach acid, dude. Like it literally... Oh, that hurts. That's not good. I, I'm sorry, but that's just not my jam. It's just not. Guess what? There's more. I don't like that. That tastes not good to me. I oh. mean, who didn't have tacos today? It's Taco Tuesday. I'm sure that's not the worst thing you've had in your mouth this week. Let me think. I mean, within yeah, the last is. running week, we shot the worst whiskey in the hut. Taco I plate. would include that in that list. Yeah. I'd include that. That can be the tiebreaker. You know what I mean? Oh, a taste of vomit. Yeah, a little bit. Like, you know how you throw oh, up man. and you're like, and everything's a little, like, burnt from the acid? Yeah, that's it. That's not good. Sorry. 640 in chat, less than 300 likes. Hit the thumbs up for okay. team. Hashtag the chemist. Can we get some? That's, that's me, if you're wondering. Can we get some likes, Thank you, please? deuces, bourbon buddy. Bile is not a good liquor favor. flavor. Nope. Wow. Yeah, I don't. You can just burn that one. Cusco, I'm sorry that we don't like these, but or we don't. We didn't like that one. Let me try this next one. Uh, but we've not heard a lot of good things about this one. We don't hear a lot of good things about a lot of Balconas, honestly. Now, the the peated I like. I like that peated too. I like actually. that one a lot. Um, um I do too. Uh, we've had some black short label list that we right like. there. We have we've had some of the black label picks. Hey, that we I'm liked. a real chemist, power keeper. No. Dan's a fake engineer. I'm a real one. Mm. For now. Try not to be. Fuck. Dan sure represents most of the time he's in the mess. Suck it. Oh, a new piece of shit. Cheech, that's the only way I can get that flavor out of my mouth. Okay, this smells better than the other one. What's this? Ooh. Texas Blue Corn Bourbon, 64 per- 64%. Uh, what we just drank that we didn't like was True Blue Cast Strength from Balcones. Oh, this smells chocolatey, dude. Isn't true blue? Is true blue bourbon or is it corn whiskey? The, I thought that was the the, the grown up version of the baby blue. Okay. So again, you we have we have not made that move yet, buddy. We're trying to do some other stuff first. Yeah, it's straight corn whiskey. Okay, I was okay. That's why it's so fucky, man. What else, what's the other one? Look like? Texas blue corn. It's the literally. Oh, yeah. this is this. Okay, these black labels are ones we've had that we've liked before. Oh, they okay. do store picks of the black labels. I did not like the one we just had. That was the blue label. Yep. We've had one black label before and we liked it. We had it when we were down in Texas with Mark. Do I say anything now? 
Oh, Chino, I literally meant to respond to you before the stream. But, yeah. Um, listen, I don't know about the American Prairie. I'm in on the other one. I've not had a... Now, I could be wrong. I've only had one American Prairie that I've ever liked, and it was Midwinter Night's Ram. Midwinter Night's Ram, yeah. yeah. But the other one sounds fantastic. Thank you for thinking of us, dude. Dan does work at a Grand Union. Kind of. I don't know if he actually works. He could be fucking lying to me. No, I do. Unfortunate. Yeah. It's, it's unfortunate, but I do. Listen, I'll tell so you. So the, the one guy that went out for open heart surgery yeah. tested positive for COVID. So now that surgery's delayed. Yeah. He's coming back to work Monday. What? Oh, we're drowning. He's coming back to work Monday with COVID? No, it, that'll be two weeks. Oh, I'm like, geez, oh, yeah. Great. What are your thoughts on Fourgate? Well, we just drank Batch, or I'm sorry. The, the Calvin Cooper 3, or we the just, Calvin Collaboration 3. We just drank Batch 12. It's fantastic. Fantastic. Most of them are really good. Yeah. Um, I the Ruby Rye. I, I love that one. I love the that Ruby Rye. That really good. I love the Ruby Rye. Dan doesn't show up to work. He has Python that jiggles his mouth all, mouse all day. His mouth all day. He jiggles that, too. You Nigga, said he has a Python... Like that script. jiggles is no 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 I know but oh un, most people probably don't understand that do they number one for sure they don't number two you also <laughs> made reference to a giant snake which some people would call their dick <laughs> yeah and then my mouth <laughs> it all makes sense there's a lot there's underlying things here there are layers to this <laughs> no no I think it works <laughs> oh. most people don't get it and that's why context is suck it <laughs> uh. <laughs> Zachary Jones, poor guy, open heart surgery, COVID, and works with Sean. He's in my thoughts and prayers. That's <laughs> nice of you. Python is perfect. He that tastes know, so, so much better than that porn shit. Oh, gosh dang it, Joe Sullivan. How dare you? I like that. That has Texas funk, but I like that. Like, this is like the expected flavor from Texas. Ooh, what that, is that? That blue corn is not good. Red breast. One ninety nine buy red, red spot. Oh, red spot. Sorry, red breast small cask. After that, small cask. I am just skipping words. This tonight. is multi. Yeah. Multi. Um. So the SRP I think is one fifty on red spot. Man, it it's really good, but one ninety nine is a lot. I'd pass on the small batch. I'd cast pass strength. on both of those. Yeah. Cathelgan. Thanks. Appreciate it. Oh, That's JP. Like Do toasted. I still fuck with Subies? Yes, we have two of them, but not fun ones. He's got two mom Subarus. Yeah. He does. Daddy's well, got a He's got a mom a Subaru. Way. Gabby's got a mom Subaru. You don't have to drive a long way. Yeah. 30 minutes each way every day. No, you don't. Yes. 15 I do. tops. But it's over 15 minutes to your house, asshole. I don't live on the way to work. Yes, you do. <laughs> I pass by your house twice a day. Well, the road your house is off of. How about that? It's hot in here. That air conditioner can't keep up. How? It's 80 something out. That's it. Wait till it's 100. I'll die in here. Yes. Just come out here. I'll be molten lava just, just melting into a I seat. get all the whiskey. I wrote it in my will to my son. That's not how it works. I think it's how it works. My well, lawyer I get half fine. of it. You have heroin in your veins. But you don't he get doesn't any. understand which one's the good one, so I'll just be handing him that, that Joe Morgan you're stuff. You're like, bad, look at the you're horse, You're a buddy. bad friend if I die and you give my son bad whiskey. You're the worst friend I have. Oh, I'm an engineer, Bro, guys. Yes, you're I am. not a fucking engineer. I'm sorry. Yeah, I am. Uh, listen, I could engineer with the best of them. We do need a mini split. We need somebody to but put up a like wall over math there. math and science or anything. No, no, no. I can engineer with the best of them. Okay. Name the smartest engineer in the world. Elon Musk. Right next to me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Easily. Ideas? Same. Oh, Dan B., we, I really like Dovetail a lot. It's Finch that Tickle, but it's probably the best Finch Tickle you'll get. I think... Uh, we have a DBA, Tim. Um, I think that I, I still stand by liking the Seagrass more. No. Nope. And it's prettier, and it's a better name, so... I'm going with seagrass over dovetail, but I do I do like dovetail. Not an engineer, Norris. That's so sad. 
That's so sad. The second one hurts worse than the first one. Isn't that This is bad? like a malty brownie batter. Like, yeah. it's really chocolatey. I think it's, like, toasty, too. It's weird. Oh, yeah. Like, it's got that toasted aspect. It's, I, listen, this makes up for the other sample. Mm-hmm. I appreciate this. Thank you for saying something good. This drink's less hot than the True Blue. Yes. True. It's oil, and more it's oily. way higher. For yeah. True. It's, almost, it's 10%. 10% higher. That's crazy. Dan and Elon stood, stood next to each other. Elon, Elon would make Dan look like an engineer for ants. Listen to me right now. Me and Elon have worked hand in hand on many projects. You guys ever heard of Teslas? <clears throat> Drew Firstenberg paid $30 for a pour of seagrass two Fridays ago, then oh. saw a local shop at 79 oh. had to just buy to dollar cost average the per- first pour down. Dude, $30? That's insane. IW Harper 15. That's like really woody. That's malty. That was a little malty. Um, it's because people were trying to compare it to Rudder 22. And it's way no. weird. No, 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 no. Yeah. Because Rugby 22 is amazing. Yeah. I.W. Harper or L.W., whichever one it is, is not as amazing. Any- <gasps> I want the Kirkland stuff so bad. Which one? No. What the fuck? Next Thursday? No. Taz, as Taz fan said, I know your name's Arizona Tasmanian Devil fan or something like that, but unfortunately it's spelled as Taz. As, as Taz fan. Um, He said you need to go to Costco and get the Kirkland Premium. No, we don't. But... <laughs> What we need to get is Kirkland just released their new Barton product. Oh, really? They released a Barton small batch for probably free, I'd imagine. Yeah. In 1792 $8. small batch we love. Yeah. Same source. If I can get Kirkland literal gallons of whiskey for $14, I'm 100% in. Oh, there it was. Tormentor 3080. He's an engineer, but the kind they use crayon with his blueprint. I mean, I'm still an engineer in that statement, so I'll take it. What's up? Oh, my God. What's up? You work in an industry that just gives made up titles. To engineers. No, just made up titles. To like engineers. When Levi worked at Savant, they were like, just come up with your own title. Did they tell him that? I'm pretty sure. Holy shit. They told him or Art to come up with their own title. That place is a joke though, so Yeah. <laughs> just make up a title. Okay. That place was still justifying needing an IT department though. Like that's where they were at. They're like, we don't think we need IT. Yeah, I work for a chemical plant that we have to justify our analytical. That makes sense to me. Yeah. You guys are fucking worthless. Uh-huh. Yeah, I get that. We're going to smoke some Alec Bradley's in a little bit here, Jacob. Yeah. Um, we're going to start doing Collector's Corner here pretty soon. So Probably not. Dan doesn't know how to work this thing. I'm the only one that knows how to work the thing. Literally. Go ahead and work it. Oh, got a little spicy with that one. <sighs> Just send a burr ride. Don't worry. It's a Can shitty bottle. Can you guys please hit the like button? I would say it's about a $29 bottle. For Sean's shitty flip. It was like two and a half. Did or... you see Will and Grace trying to fucking imitate me? No. Oh my gosh. Let me, let me re, let's imitate them for a second, okay? You're going to be Kessler. Grace. I'm going to be Will for Kessler. It looks like you're about to get a little flippy. The Kessler. All the way bottom shelf. Don't do that. It was a gift to me, okay. fucker. So, they're like, Will goes... They're sitting next to each other. I'm going to need you to catch this. Just be aware. Will goes, oh, burp, 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 burp. I'm Dan Shook. And then he goes. And I'm like, what was that? <laughs> That's the worst flip I've ever seen in my life. It didn't flip. I it literally, I don't even think they flipped it. I literally could watch it. I could literally do this. Oh, I almost caught that. Okay, let me try one more wait, time. Wait. Okay. Oh, you did it! <laughs> All right, hold on. Was that a half? Oh, you broke oh, the cap. Oh, it's broke. It doesn't matter. It's Kessler's. Thanks, James. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're done. We're done with that. Man, you're bad at this. We're done with this. Oh, it's so wet. Okay, wait. I just need to get a... Okay, there we go. Easy. Did it! <laughs> yeah, yes! Two in. And... Okay, it did... That was... I think it wasn't worth <laughs> it just to have that on my hand. Well, I mean, it killed some, some germies. Listen... How long are Will and Grace going to ride? Well, Jermaine, I, so I talked to Grace today because they have a video idea, and I'm like, they're like, oh, we should include you guys. Read this book what? about blood pressure medicine. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> they were like, uh, Grace is like, we have this video that we want to do. And I'm like, oh, that sounds like a good idea. 
And then he said, yeah, oh, we should have included you guys in it. Maybe we could just send you guys up samples or something. And I'm like, how far away are you guys from us? Like, are you guys six hours? And he's like, I don't know. So I looked it up. Come to find out they're nine hours from us. <laughs> That's a long freaking place. Yeah, ways. too far. And so then he was like, do you guys have a Southwest, like an airplane Southwest up there? I'm like, MBS has literally everything because mm-hmm. they're like a large airport. Yep. And he's like. No, not MBS. DTW? Yeah. Uh, yeah, DTW. And so, well, Detroit, whatever. So I'm sitting there and we we're talking about it. And then I was like, wait, we're coming down to do a wilderness trail and a Yellowstone pick on the 21st. Yep. And I know that's not where they're at, but it's nope. much closer. Not nine hours. It's like three, two or yep. three. We take the new car? I wanted to, did you, I looked up how far away Yellowstone is there. Uh, Seven and a half. That's fun. It's a long We fly it? <laughs> it's a long So then I'm like, maybe we meet. Maybe they come on the Wilderness Trail and Yellowstone pick with us. Boo. <laughs> <laughs> and then we can shoot that video idea that they had with them. Yeah. Like the night before or something. Is it Kentucky KYO1? Is that the same? Someone asked. Yes, yes, that's yes, KYO1. KYO1. Or K, it's Kentucky 1. Where were we going there? I don't, I genuinely, am not, I got lost in the middle of Kentucky. I saw it happen in live time. Everyone else got to see it too, big Have dog. You still no toast? Idea. You okay? How are you feeling? You drink enough water? So the other night we got home from up north, and I was streaming on Twitch, and I'm like, I'm just going to stream for like a couple hours probably. I just wanted to chill. I was there. No, you weren't. Mm-hmm. It was Sunday night. Yeah. So anyways. I was there. My eyes, I swear to God, it looked like I took 14 <laughs> edibles. And I'm like, I'm completely sober. I haven't even drank alcohol. My eyes are like, I can't open them. I have no idea. I have no clue. Oh, Sean, <laughs> the same car. face I made drinking 130 proof midwinter. Okay. You know what? <laughs> you guys, I don't want to fucking hear about it. We at Whiskey Weekend, we have a thing. We got to come up with like a show idea. I want, I want crowd fucking people. involvement. Yep. Okay. And I want to embarrass everyone. I mean, it, it sounds like you want to fuck the crowd there for a minute. I do, but not like physically. Okay. More like mentally. <laughs> yeah. Emotionally. So, yeah. Emotionally. I want to cripple them for life. Oh, shit. <clears throat> okay, so we did the samples. that I, We needed to get through some of those. There's a one of these Penelope's I want you to try because I think it's really fantastic. Is it the open one? They're all open. Oh. So, um, but I tried all three of them. It's this one. Okay. Ian, you ain't wrong. Glass bottle outlet is legit. It it's is. It's all we used. Yeah, it really is. There, that's why there's a link in the description. Yeah, this is definitely Well, Cheech just posted it. Wrap it. So now, the uh, Penelope did get this up here, mm-hmm. so you don't have to like it. Okay, I'm just telling everybody in stream they fucking sent it. They sent three. This is by far my favorite one. Now hold on, I want to give you a heads up. This is a blend, barrel corn. strength blend, yeah. private select, which is kind of like a pick series. Yeah, I saw corn. It's four years old. Corn rye wheat is okay. a mash bill, so it's a weeder. So why? Didn't you engineer a grease, bro? <laughs> yep. What's up, John Shadow? Thanks for being here, buddy. Appreciate I have it. chronic heartburn. I just recently. We need to get some new stickers made like, for what? For the chat. Did you say I need to? No, I said we. I thought you said you need to. I almost <laughs> open hand slapped you. <laughs> I said we. I said, bitch. <laughs> you said you it though, get right? Them made. You said it though, you right? Hey, tell me made. the name of your uh, artist there for the those. Hey. For those? Yeah. Okay, I'll give you that that person. Okay. The what emotes? what no, go ahead. format does the sticker lady need it? I don't in? know. What just any. any. Okay. It doesn't matter. She need a vector? I, do you need it to be fucking huge for some reason? Yeah, I could. Just wraps the whole <laughs> Yeah. Up. It's actually all encompassing. That'd be actually really cool. Yeah. Kinda like the idea a little more now. Uh I oh. so this this part I have the best idea ever is now. gonna happen. Uh, just I know have that. the best idea ever now, but I don't think that Bourbon Outfitters is going to want to take part. <laughs> you know yeah. I mean? They might just be shipping my sticker next to the bottle, you know? <laughs> no, I meant because I, it's going to be too much work to apply it because of how I have the best sticker idea ever, but I can't even do it. That's so sad. Because I'd have to send the illustrator or the, the sticker lady a, a bottle so she could fit it. It'd be amazing. That's pretty good. It's this I okay. This is 115 proof. Fuck, would that be hard to guess? At what the proof? Price proof distillery. Um, Mostly that distillery. 
Four years, non-chill filtered. I believe this is, dist- yeah, distilled in Indiana. Yeah, this, um, I, it's, this is what it looks like for those watching. It's a black label with gold writing on it. They're it's got doing, that MGP sweetness on it. They're doing a toasted series as well, and they're going to do so toasted in. picks. But this one's my favorite one. Dude, I love that. That's a crushable 115er, for sure. Oh, okay. You you kind of described that to me a little wrong. Why? Because it's corn bourbon, rye bourbon, wheat bourbon. Oh, really? Yeah. It's a four grain. Yeah. Because that's what it says on the back. That's fantastic. Yeah. I love that. So, oh, let me read that real quick. So, it is 31.3% corn bourbon, 31.3% rye bourbon, and then 37.4 wheat bourbon. It's really good. What the fuck is corn bourbon? So a stereotypical mash bill. Okay, is corn, rye, and right. malted so, but, barley. But it's high corn generally, right? And then a rye would be a high, high rye. rye. Okay. And then a wheat would be a, a wheated bourbon. Okay, I'm good with that. A local Facebook group just did a Penelope pick. That is their first true single barrel, five-year MGP, 115 non-chill filter, really good stuff. This is fantastic. Dude, fantastic. I really love this a lot. Um, what are I, the other two that we have? The other one was a this red label, which is okay. This feels like a... I would imagine this is a cheaper product on the shelf because this tastes like a little bit less... I'm not as impressed with this. This is the Penelope Straight Bourbon Whiskey Barrel Strength. This is a four grain as well. Um, this one... Ha- See, this one has less information than everything See, this else. nose has got me all left up. I love I that I don't know what name. I would... Guess this as. And then this, um, this is a medium toast four year Penelope barrel strength four grain. But this one has more like the leather tobacco on it. And I was talking to him mm. today on yeah. Instagram and he said that these, like, there's still a bunch of these in the toasted barrels. Okay. So they're letting them go longer. Yeah. And he goes, dude, the longer I'm letting all of them go, the better they're all getting. Okay. So I, I told him I'm excited to see with when these. Are in the toasted barrels longer if they're how good they are. Uh, Jason, it does. It says corn bourbon on it. Yeah. So I don't know if it's just like super high. Like maybe it's ninety nine percent corn. Like that's the only thing I can think of. Yeah, this one's more leathery. It has the toasted like sweetness, but this one, I think this one's so damn. This is one of my favorite four year MGP whiskeys I've had. They do a good, damn good job blending, apparently, because that's fantastic. Thrasher said Penelope is a New Jersey brand. Bottle right down the street from me. MGP four grain. Great guys. Oh, okay. that's cool. Yeah, that's really I good. I didn't know that's where they were from. I didn't realize it was four grain. where they were at, I guess. But, yeah, Stroke Wagon is my Twitch. Somebody asked for it. Not a big deal. Just, you know, what's up? Um, Penelope Black Label MSRP. I don't know. Evan Williams in the not jug, sure. not a glass bottle. I don't remember that. Sending me a, a DM. Was an Instagram then? Wait. Actually, I don't know if y'all remember me sending a DM to y'all showing a Evan Williams in the jug. Uh, listen, man, there's a lot there's of a lot DMs. Of Is it, was it on Insta? Because if it was on was Insta, your dick in there? Shit ton. Dan would remember that. A lot of people send Dusties and ask for prices on them, and I'm like, I don't know. Oh, uh, yeah, I have no idea. So, uh, what's the SRP on that? I don't know. Fuck. Yeah. I don't, I don't even know. What would you pay? I don't. It's fantastic. I think I wish that we could do a barrel pick of that, and I don't know if that's an option. I know that they're talking about doing toasted I hope it's picks. it's under 65. Right around that range, I think it's... Little craft tax on yeah. it. Barrel proof. Five-year MGP. Really well 65 blended, 65 feels man. like it would be perfect. It's really well blended, honestly. Are all the Penelope Black Label... Penelope Black Label sorbets? I don't think so. Steve said, your Twitch is a big deal when YouTube shits about That's fair. We got to back up. Constantly. What pin hook? Um, Sean doesn't like pin hook. I like some pin hooks. Okay, so let's do a collector's corner. Yep, right after you read some patrons. All right, we're going to read patrons, then we're going to do a collector's corner. you got to read two pages. I'm going to read one page right now. Two pages. Price Eubanks. Fuck my eyes. Ryan (laughs) and Els. Jason Harris. Donnie Engel. Donnie Engel. Travis Wagand. Man, you guys' names are hard as shit right now. We've not had watershed bourbon, I remember. Um, Todd Rosenthal, David Fiddler, the second, Nathan Watts, John, Joe Meyer, Mike Booth, Hugh Hayes, DJ Beacon, Patrick Knight, Ashley, Frank, comma, Ashley, comma, Frankie, <laughs> Jimmy Munt, Fanny, Jeff Bertholdi, David Hughes, Alex Spurlock, Kane Heathman, Defiance Welding. 
Ken. 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 Ken Heitman. Defiance Welding. Rain A. Robert Bailey. Andrew Wall. Jesse Land. Samuel Shafa. I'm not, you know. At Avaria. Avaria. I don't know, man. This I'm one's sorry. fun, too, for a Polak. J. Peter Skins. Oh, <laughs> dude, no way. Yeah. There's no way that's your real yes. name. And if it is, I'm sorry. I'm, sh- dude. Is your name really Peter Skins? Oh, uh, no. It's uh, P E D E R S K I N Z, Peter Skins. Arturo Cahu, Colin Zeigel, Mitch Cavanaugh, Philip Dominguez, Gerard, Jarrett Ross, Tanner Robinson, Tony Two Toes. Gerard? Did you just read that? <laughs> <laughs> I said Gerard. <laughs> Tony Tutos, Tom B, Zachary Greer, Jimmy Munt, Matthew Green, Joshua Day, Tamita, Matt Horn, Andrew <laughs> Morris, Tyler Harvey, Jackson Willoughby, Northwest Bourbon, Luke Sherman, Gavin Heslop, and Ben. Thank you guys all for joining our Patreon. We're bumping around in the old tiers in there. We appreciate you guys joining over there. There's behind the scenes over there. Oh, There's uh, weekly updates over there. There's barrel picks for the channel. That's so the only place to go. That's where our challenge coins actually sold out over there last time, so they didn't go to the public. Everything's released there first. So 50 more. Jump if down. you hit up Patreon, that's where all the stuff is dropped first. There's 84 more. Yeah, um, no, you just, I want you to do one more page. 50. Mike Booth, BDC, nope, BCD Monkey, Tom Amondo, David Morton, Brent Nixon, Paul G. Weckesser, Paul G. Weckesser again, Bob Ullman, Adam Berkowitz, Jordan Harwell, Jimmy Munt. I mean, Jimmy Munt, I see your name a lot. Whitney Norris Branch. <laughs> Timothy Juarez, Brian Johnson, Joff De Natala, Dan Dawson, Scotty Williams, <laughs> Lee, Dan Vincent, Zach, Don Thompson, Dustin Miracle, Tra- Taylor Cohen, Blake Jordan. That's got to be a porn star's name. Blake Jordan has to be a Feels porn like star's it. name. Shane Hoskins, Ralph Saldana, Matt Huckabee, Nicholas Singer. You guys would be proud of me on that one. Because it doesn't There's look a silent like. There's P a, in the front there. It's a singer. <laughs> Tyler Sanders, Cody Lee, Calf Guy 33, Jacob Eberts, Nathan Whittle, Gavin Piper, Jerry Castleberry, bumped to a fucking big one. Ted Adams, bumped to a big one. DJ Beacon, Joe now you're reading those. Kakosa, Ross Tamazin. I even pronounced the thinger correctly. Clint Hughes, bumped to a fucking big one. Matt Medford, Matthew S. Meyer, Adam Passau, Eric Rising, Edward Babarabit. Mario Ricci, Jay Peterskins, another Peterskin. <laughs> there's no fucking way there's two Peterskins with different names, dude. There's no way. Michael DeMaria, Matt Schwanda, and Betsy Sims. Thank you guys all for joining. Holy Jeez. shit. There were some rough ones today. Byron said, it's Byron, the wise before the R, the fuck, man. Byron, you try to read 200 fucking names in about a minute and a half, dude, and get them all right. And drink. <laughs> and read it on the screen. And, and the last do 34? It no. <laughs> Not, uh, next week, 34 more patrons. Uh, Paul Wax said, Dan, pretty good job of my last name. There, that's what I'm talking about. We got a double Peter skin in there. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All right. So, <laughs> gosh, dude. Or Richard Foreskin's a good buddy of mine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Sense. So, we're going to do some uh, collector's, corners. collector's Corners is what we call these. <laughs> We haven't done one in a while. You okay, buddy? People on the Twitch stream were like, bro, you haven't done one in so long. I said, fine, we'll do one. Fucking complainers. So that's what we're going to do. If you guys haven't seen Collector's Corner, we look at people's collections, and we just recommend a non-expensive, pretty readily available bottle, and an expensive, maybe harder to find bottle, based on the things they already have. That's how it goes. <laughs> Very easy. Okay. Oh, Jason. Gosh. <laughs> Oh, y'all are some funny mother effers. You guys are not good with this pun. I want you to know that. No, they're fantastic. Hope you're a better train driver than reader. Why? I don't even know what you're that. you're an engineer. Oh, yeah. All right. Shit. All right. You want to so, start at the end? No. Others scroll down a little bit because I told one of these people we'd do it. Uh, That one. This one? Mm-hmm. Would that one? No, one above it. He did There's put, no pictures he did in put that one. Hashtag. Why did he send two? Delete that one. Damn it, Zachary Jones. He did put five, hashtag. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> so, we don't have the... Yeah, we do. Click the new scene. Oh, you set it up? That's slightly annoying. That's too long. Yeah, it is. I can remove that really quick. All right. So, that's what they're seeing now. 
hopefully you wanted them to see what's there. This is just a window capture, so anything in this window they're going to see. Good to know. Turn that off. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So. I'll close that Pornhub window. <laughs> Austin said, I'd send mine in, but I have too many unopened bottles. Okay. Holy shit. So, this is Zachary Jones. I right? just got to keep her yeah, below that. Wait, scroll. I wanted to see. What was being? Oh, there it is. Hashtag fire shot. This is the best. There's definitely more than 66 likes, Shep. It must be like a refresh thing, buddy. I don't know how many there are, but he's got a hand-signed John Thick red label Mayor Pangry. Yeah, he does. Um, he won that. He's got an old Kirk. He's got our pick. Yeah, uh, our best pick so far. Um, okay, so this is like the budget-ish table with a random Sam Houston 14 and stack Jr. in there. Old Kirk's not expensive. There's two Blantons. Okay, 60. There's an E.H. Taylor. I see at least 60. two Weller Antique 107s. 60. 65. Buy me one at 60. 120. Buy me one at 60. Easily done You it. just called this the budget. You are literally... Okay, that's just the same table. Yeah, okay. Now okay. there's empty glasses on it. Okay. Oh, okay, these are all the same pictures. This is just it. Okay. All right, so go back to the first... The fir first picture is pretty all-encompassing, I yep. feel like. Lots of Sazerac. Like a lot. Like a shit ton. Weller, Weller, Sag Jr., E.H. Taylor, Buffalo Sag. Trace, Saz Rye, two Blantons. Buffalo Trace. Oh, there's a Sag Jr. in the back. Oh, yep. Yeah, there's, uh, there's one hiding in there. Oh, there is a 1792 right there. Full proof. Could be. It's a black label. Yeah. Yellowstone. Sean is mad bougie all of a sudden. You just said that this was the fucking... What? Budget table. Like, we haven't seen a stag junior at a store I'm in a used year. to people sending in their collections, and they're like, <laughs> I got every bottle of whiskey ever made. Oh. We did, like, three of those last time. Do you not remember Jeffrey that? Jeffrey Jones said I'm poor. <laughs> I mean, you have an old Kirk, and we don't. So, you technically... Gosh. Um, you already have one? <clears throat> Cheap one or expensive one? <clears throat> oh, I'm just writing stuff down. Right. Budget bougie. Oh, okay. <laughs> Um, I have my budget for sure. Me too. I swear to God, if it's the same, I'm not looking at Sean's. If it's the same, it's the same. Um, bougie. My budget is 1792 small bag. Oh, mine's rare breed. Okay. Um, How 17, do you not own rare breed. Good 1792 sir. small batch. I was going to say that. With the flavor profile on the table, which is a lot of Sazerac mm -hmm. and like red cherry, like Barton. Unless Early it, times, like, it's all really sweet whiskey. Okay, very old Barton 100. What's that? The, the, well, they don't, the bottle and bond that they used to do. Very old Barton 100. Yeah. That's, oh, the white yeah. label one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy shit, I forgot all about that whiskey. Yeah. That would fit in the flavor profile. But, I don't make it. Dan B said, budget table, we have way different budgets. Yeah, I don't know. Sean's fucking high. I apologize. Um, <laughs> Sean's like, nah, only Blattens and Stag Jr., eh? <laughs> Budget. Is that a little tank array at the front of the table? What the fuck is that little green bottle with the little cup? What is? Why is there a little cup? Zachary Jones, why is there a small cup towards the bottom or front of the table? Why is that? Is that a long branch? Yeah. No, is that a captain's? It's got a neck taggy thing. Is that a dickel bottle? Oh, the barrel slack? Yeah, it could be. Maybe. He hit it. Rightfully so. Well, I mean, if we go to the next picture, is it... Is it <gasps> He's got a Chattanooga port. It's this That's one. a dickle. Yeah, it's yep. dickle. That. Oh, that's the other bottle that's hiding this. That's a Chattanooga port finish. That shit's fantastic. Bro, why don't you have the 111 in your life? Oh, I didn't see that. I didn't either. Hmm, a bougie bottle. What? Are, okay, so budget wise, probably somewhere like hundred or less range for the most part. Let's pretend he got, got these my bougie all around retail. Got you know my bougie. Saying? I like how even in this picture the dickel's hidden. Like he took different angles and it's still <laughs> hidden. I mean, I get it. <laughs> um, I'm gonna say for bougie. Yep. I'm gonna say Sam Houston 15. Fuck you. Did you really? I said it first. Yeah, but mine's wrote down. Said it out loud. Rewind yes. the tape. 
I also agree. Sam Houston 15. 15 would be a good bougie bottle. Like a one, that's like a 130. Yeah. But it's really good. Um, Beer boots. Yeah, that's what he, he Russo pours those. <laughs> one. Uh, um, Maybe, yeah, there's an old tub hidden in there too. FAE 01 out of 10. Um, Eight. You know what my, my other uh, bougie would be is an ECBP A121. That'd be the other one. Here, hold on. Let me change the transition before you do that so it doesn't do that every time. That'd be great. Well, they're going to see this. That's okay. No, they're not. Because it's screen capture, or it's a window capture. Oh, okay. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. Not a big deal. I just know all the things. Engineer them daily. You're Boom. Right. Look at that. You, oh, you just change it to the amazing. default transition. No, that's not default. Fade. Cut. Default. Idiot. Oh, my God. It is on the default list. I, we made that a long time ago. Well, yeah. now I say we like you did it, but I did it. You, know you suck my butt. So, all right. Thank you for sending that, buddy. I hope that's helpful. For real, get your shit together with the 1792 small batch. Though. Will you start it so we don't redo it? Thank Watch you. this. And now just pick Burr. up. Now random. Random. -er. Just random. -er. And boom. Nailed it. Embellish hmm. podcast. Uh, okay. I was like, is there seriously not a freaking picture in here? No, I saw it. I had pictures. All right. Okay. Do the thing. Seen her. Quick. S seen her. Just met her. Any update on the team blending bottles, fits bottles? No. So, Tom, they're all going to make content. And then uh, HBR just passed his on um, oh, to time. Perry. About time. So, anyway. Where's yours at? On the fourth stop. Where's yours at? On the fourth one. Secrets. Um, Apparently, other people are better at this than us. So, once they all shoot the cons like their content and then it gets to the judges, to the I think Matt wants them to all put out their videos. Yep. So, the videos will all come out like within a week or two weeks' time. So, so I know. It's only on the third stop. Hey, how many bottles of Zachary Jones's were sealed? I didn't even like look none. at that. Well, they were all open? Like two stag. I think the stag in the back might have been sealed. Zachary Other Jones? Other than that, I don't think a lot of them. Okay. Hey, is there sun behind this cabinet? Because I would move it. All right. That looks like sunlight to me. Just a heads up. Who's a, whose collection is this? Embellished Podcast. Oh, yeah. You already okay. said it. So, there's... Oh, what's that OFC thing right there? Oh, look. Look at that pretty one. Mm, 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 mm. Can they see my mouse? <laughs> I don't know. That's a good question, actually. I hope not. <laughs> Just skull F in that thing. Okay. What's that OFC next to the Blantons on the right? What is that? Old, Old filthy, filthy cockroach. <laughs> that must be a barrel pick sticker. Oh, it's a Buffalo Trace. Yeah. Okay. That's funny. It is. Okay. This is deep. I hope there's another picture. That is very deep. Because this is like three deep. I mean, that's the row series yeah. with a store pick. Yep, they can see your mouth. Oh, no. Oh, okay. How many Scotch Malt Whiskey Society bottles have you hooligans acquired? Well, will we start seeing them in your place? Well, about 16. There's a lot. I think I I bought five. You got conned in that Castle and Key bottle. It's a really cool bot. Don't say con. I, don't know, I liked it more than you. Wait, what? Did, he asked for us to pick Rise. Is that what he said? I don't know. It's in his thinger. You're going to show everybody's email in a second yeah. here. One sec. <laughs> Trying to not dox people. One is collection mostly. Other is the Rye other shelf. And he said help with... What? He didn't say help with. Help with the rights. The title of the email. Okay. It okay. does say that. Agree to agree, huh? Agree to agree. All right. Switch your stream labs. It's like coaching a fucking child. Why don't you suck my butt? Gosh. Put two lips on my butt. <laughs> the lack of organization of these shelves is giving me anxiety. Christopher R., what's up, buddy? How's it going, dude? How are you? Tormentor said he just lost power, too. Why? Apparently Where do you you're guys next live? to. Uh, yeah, hey, maybe you guys could be friends. You and Aiden. Okay. Okay, Cooper's Craft, fantastic. Still sealed, open it. You know what I mean? He said help with rye. You want a good rye? Rise. I got a bougie rye already. That I don't Do see. Do you see a rye shelf, though? Yeah, the bottom. You're what? an idiot. That restoration's a rye? That whole bottom right's a rye shelf, buddy. Literally everything I, on I, it, I, except the Traverse State chair. I'll give you yeah, that. I looked at that, and I was like, where the hell is the rye shelf? So I'm supposed to tell you to... Oh, I mean, there's a High West right there. Yeah. But that's American Brewery. Yeah. Help with the rye shelf. Well, I can't really see her there, bud. There's a whistle pig. Lot 40. It looks like an Emerald Giant. 
Okay, I got baby Saz, old overhaul. Wow, I just realized I'm an alcoholic. Um, it just hit you, huh? Yeah. <laughs> took you a lot longer than it took me to figure out. Like, hey, we have one of those. Really? Yeah. Did you? <laughs> like how you were calling bottles in the back of that shelf. You can barely see a neck tag on. And then the, you go, no, oh, we got rag proppers. It was the last thing. Suck them up. All right. I have a fancy one. All righty. Easy peasy. you going in freaking squeezy. Fancy already, huh? Uh, Christopher Hart said, miss you guys. Miss you too, buddy. Kind of do something oh, that's together the fancy pretty soon. One. Work on opening some rides before you ask for recommendations. Well, I mean, the Jack is open. The Restoration's open. The Lot 40 is open. The Saz is open. The Peerless is open. <laughs> the right. only one I see that's not open is the E.H. Taylor. I got my bougie rye also. Okay. My bougie rye. I think I get to go first this time. Okay. Mixer's toasted. Oh, you're rye. an idiot. That's a dumb bougie rye. Yeah, but we love it. I'm going to go with... Oh, we love it. Huh. I figured... Oh, my God. You're not going to say Midwinter's? No. Whoa! But I am now, because that's a really good suggestion. I 100% thought you were going to go Midwinter's. Yeah, Midwinter Night Stream. You're welcome. Uh, I had a different recommendation. I backed off because of the price tag. Solely because of the price tag. Okay. You're just going to say the ruby? No. No, I actually... That would have been a good one, too. Yeah. Shit. I'm apparently full of them. I'll, uh, I'll owl. recommend that to someone else later. Owl. You're going to say owl, But it's huh? too expensive. It's $300. Now. Non... Oh, man. What cheap rise do I like that you don't have right there? Oh, I, I got... Forrester rye. Oh, uh, uh, Michter's, Michter's single barrel rye for me. Th- that was easy. That was super easy. Oh, I haven't had a Mc- Michter's single barrel in a while. It's I remember so that good, like man. That. It's so good. Embellish, thank you for sending that, buddy. Appreciate it, man. Old Carter rye? Oh, we missed. That's That was the one. But but the thing is, is none of those ryes were like $200. I went semi not super expensive. Yeah, well, kind of. What mixture's toasted rye? How much is that? One twenty-five. If you find it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. If you just want it, it's like one seventy-five, two twenty-five. Okay. Cheaper than old Carter? No. Yeah. Not true. Old Carter's two hundred. So one seventy-five would be cheaper than two twenty-five. Okay. I give you a range. Who knows? Secondary right, we're go up again tomorrow. I said, hey Seth. fellas. Oh, Ram. Okay. Hopefully the noise gates have been on us. They've been listening to the... Uh, Nobody's bitched about it. This would be an easy and one. And if I know one thing about people in chat, they like to complain about us doing things incorrectly. Uh, Jonathan Vinkel said, I got my mixture's toasted barrel rye for 89 Okay. Seth said, Don't long-time watcher, Don't first-time writer. It lives in Oregon. Got everything here for SRP-ish. Really enjoying the Knob Creek 9 single right now. Weather 1-7. Is ECB all timers okay? So just gonna read that if we're uh, I like more. these collections are so much nicer to do. Yeah, it's like then when they have a million, yeah. yeah. Okay, I get oh that like this uh the zoom's in a weird place. I would call this a really good. Hey, close your uh, downloads down there real quick, just so we can see a tiny bit more, and then chat won't see it either. Hey, um, they're just looking at. It. Oh, that was a weird name. What? Not a naked chick. Dot exe, huh? That's weird. <laughs> Um, it's not. Oh, he's got a little sketch action, This is too. a really good, I got whiskey into whiskey drinking, like yeah. a year ago collection. He's got a Toast EC, uh, Elijah Craig. I actually like Henry McKenna's a lot. I don't think they're worth like a charge. Oh, I didn't charge, even see that. I, like I was looking at this. He's got an ECBP. He's got the American. Got Larceny BP. Got Weller. There's actually a handful of weeders there, huh? Yeah. Hand, three weeders right in a row. Right yeah. See, and then you got the Basil Hayden's, and you got the Knob Creek oh. Nine, and the Bullet Barrel Strang. I feel like some of these are like. <laughs> Con B just said, whiskey. just say WFE four on any picture without it. Price for experience is tough to beat. What was it? Uh, Willett Family Estate. 4. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah. Chris Barr said his bong's on the table. Why is the bong water so brown? I assume he's talking about the Willett Boss stuff. <laughs> I now listen. A lot of these whiskeys are nutty. You got Russell's, Larceny, yep. Bullet, Knob Creek, Willet, maybe seventeen nine two foolproof a little bit. Basil Hayden's absolute nut water. <laughs> what? So surprised Beam doesn't send us stuff. Okay, I've got my bougie bottle. Okay. 
Um, <laughs> Joe Sullivan said Manny likes nuts. Are you talking about Sean or are you talking about the picture? What would I do? Because the best part is Sean keeps coming up with ball references and nut references. I want to say that, but... Nut water. <laughs> what? I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why, for some reason, that, like, rang a fucking <laughs> funny bell in my head, dude. Oh What's your my fucking God. problem, man? Did you settle the hell down? Oh, okay. Um, what a... I would... <sighs> what do you think... What do I you, got both mine. What's your price range on your cheaper? Uh, $40. Okay. What's your price range on your high? 150 Oh, you to- went... What the fuck are you looking at? One fifty to two on this collection. Yeah, easy. You want what? me to say them? Sure. Okay, so my cheap budget one was Ezra ninety nine. Oh, that's a good one. That's nutty. And then my bougie was Wild Turkey Master Keep. Just fucking find anyone. Buy the next one. Buy the one that's, that's on too the shelf. Expensive. Yeah, it's a bougie bottle. I know, but he doesn't have a lot of. And he doesn't have any two hundred dollars. Yeah, but more likely than not, he's gonna buy that bottle and really enjoy it. Are you saying that you can't enjoy a bottle under two hundred dollars, you bougie bitch? No, I'm saying that if he spent the money on it, he would like Sean's it. Sean's the bougie one. Tonight, Old huh? fits. Sean's the That's bougie. That's another good one. Sean is he canter. The bougie tonight. Why? See first table, budget table, St. Junior's Blanton's everywhere. <laughs> right? You see this one? You go give him a two hundred dollar bottle. Fuck it. Chat's throwing out fucking solid. You can't ever trust chat. Okay. Uh, forty six cash rank would be a good one. Someone said is okay, but he's got hype. It's got some weeders on there. Sean does like nuts, as that emote from Lane Scott just put up there said. I'm infuriated by nuts. <laughs> <laughs> is what that is. Um, I would say for my, see my problem. I'm having a hard time with the price range because I have a bottle. I just don't know which one it fits in the cheap one or the bougie one. I'm gonna I went, say I went ultra bougie on this. That is one. gonna fit in the cheap one because okay. you can get it at Costco, and it's like forty or fifty dollars. Uh, Belvini. Um, oh, you went scat the twelve. Huh? The, the double wood? Yes. Yep. The one that's finished in bourbon. It's fantastic. Cast. It's really good. Beautiful proof. Fantastic. Super easy. Is super to drink. Bourbon and port? I don't remember what the two are, but it fits yeah, into the Scotch good. collection. He's got a bunch of Glen Morangi, Glen Morangi which is yeah. really, really chill and I sweet. I almost said what Jay Hamilton said. KC12. Yeah. For the bouge. Which one's the 12? The, is that the blue, blue and label? blue and gold one, the sweeter blue one. Label, that's a good we one. like that one yeah, more than the 15. Yeah, he likes nutty whiskey. Yeah. What's nutty whiskey? Not great. Give me some nuts. Bookers. Put your nuts on me. I mean, you don't have any bookers in there. That's I'm going 100. bougie. I'm going rare breed. 60 bucks. No, it's not. It's 46. Could be where he lives. You don't know. <clears throat> I think he's in Oregon. Oregon. Everything's expensive in Oregon, as we know. High cost of living. Beautiful place to live. I don't know what that. Okay, that's what you're going with. I huh? forget they can't see us. I could do some wild shit when you got that screen up. I will punch you in the and fucking. I throat. could literally. Thank you, Seth, for we could that. come back, and I'm just naked in this chair. You'd be. I'd be coming back, <laughs> and you're back. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! Okay, rare breeds the opposite of bougie. I know, but like his collection isn't really bougie. Okay, I'm gonna go back. I should have recommended a nice sixty dollars. <gasps> I have a different bottle to recommend. Go ahead. Russell's Reserve Rye. That's my bougie one. Sixty to seventy dollars. He doesn't have rye. Let's let's expand the collection. And that's nutty. It's a turkey product. <clears throat> Fantastic. All right. I'm great at this. <laughs> All right. So this is from James Excel. What? I bet he's rich. Uh, <laughs> this is my current collection. My favorite is the Barrel Dovetail. Good man. Sazerac Rye. He clearly H. hasn't Taylor. had But it's two hundred now at the stores. Ew, they just found the Buffalo what? Trace. Solid price with port. They're for Bell Mead. He likes Woodford. He likes Heaven's Door. Dickle. Yep. My, no, he said my least, my least favorite, favorite is Heaven's Door. Dickle. So you don't right. like Dickle, probably. <sighs> Colorado Honey's Distillery, sort of, at Durango, Colorado. They make a lot of cars. Give your thoughts. Definitely need to get Recommendations. Oh, see? Nice little, little collection. Oh, I like the organization. Interesting counters. Bam. Granite. Yeah, but the design is interesting. I don't know if I've ever seen design like it that. It could be painted. All right. All right. <laughs> I like how he just puts in the empty buffalo empty trace. Buffalo trace. Noah's Mill. <clears throat> it's not bad. Uh, what's the other one? Noah's Mill and... Rowan's Creek. Rowan's Creek. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I, we like Noah's Mill more than Rowan's Creek. Well, they're both fine. Dovetail. They're both a Barrel pass. rye. Oh, that's just barrel whiskey. Saz. 
two Woodford Rye. I like Double that Oak, sense, Heaven's yeah. Daughter. Gentleman Jack, a man of the I'm, people. I'm in on you, that gentleman Jack. That, that's you. Colorado, honey. Yeah. Pikesville. Oh, he it's got kinda, swindled. Kinda, we all did. Uh, <laughs> and we didn't even get views. So, um, okay. Mm. What's So, what's our top dollar we're here? Looking? I don't know, because barrels are 100. Yeah. Easily. Barrels are at least 100. Okay. So, he's got three of them. So I think hundreds a safe bet, but he's also got a handful of cheaper models, especially if you got a lot of that stuff at retail. Like the Weller Special Reserve retail is really low. Dicks. Fuck, I almost read it. <clears throat> These collections are making me feel like an alcoholic. You should come to the hut. <laughs> um. All right. So I wrote down my budget bottle. Okay. Um. For budget, I like this collection because he's got rye. He's got bourbon. He has one little weeder in there. He's got a little bit of finished stuff with the honey, the cold brew, and the dovetail. Man, I like Sazerai, dude. Where's the cold brew? Um, that right to the right of your mouse. That's a honey cold brew, it says. Oh, I was thinking Jameson. Like, oh, uh, the, I love that, that, one, that cold shit, brew. man. Um, if you're going to buy Jameson. Aren't you guys proud of us? We haven't said Old Forester once yet. I you said, said Old Forester Rye. Right. Yeah, liar. but now we you always said say 1920. We always say like 1920. Well, my not. bougie bottle for this class. <laughs> Um, I'm going to say... Oh, I don't like that anymore. I wrote Knob Creek 9. Yeah, what? What? It's like... 120 plac- proof? It's like placebo. What? Placebo? Yeah, because you... Or wait, what's it called? When you... Because you saw it from the last collection, so it carried over. Mental tracking. That's what it's called. <clears throat> Okay, that was fucking rough. What was that the term you taught me that I use in correctly? Memory often? effect. That's memory effect. That was actually memory effect. Nope. Yeah, it was. No, don't remember. Your that. memory was affected by the Nine Creek Nine in the last picture. You brought it to the table for this picture. I win. Oh my gosh, that was a fucking animal that just landed on my foot from this table. I hate you so much. Um. Okay. So, I I, I think every one of these is open. Yeah. Except maybe the unfortunately, you know, I want to suggest an Irish. Because he only Ew. has proper 12 on no. there. And he's like, Irish whiskey probably sucks. It does, for the most part. Um, it's good if you put cold brew in it. So, I'm going to go... What did he say that he liked? ECBP was one of his all-time favorites, right? Yeah. I'm going to go with I the have my 1792 bougie. bottled and bond for my cheaper. Okay. I think that's a good one. I won't say my... I don't have a cheap one yet. I only have my bougie. What's your bougie? Uh, Jack Daniels single barrel barrel proof. Okay. That's fair. It's like 60 bucks. Yeah. He There's, likes proof. He does? I guess barrel's there. Well, barrel's the only of, high proof thing there. He's got a barrel rye. Oh, man, it's so weird because those... He said he likes the those million barrels. proof. He said yeah. Dovetail's his favorite. Yeah. I don't know the proof on Dovetail. Let's see. Can we... 122.9-ish. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's high. That's actually higher than the rye right next to it. Okay, um, hot. Right. So I'm for my um, for my bougie. Yep. I'm going to go with. Man, that's too expensive. How bougie you want to get? My bougie is sixty. <sighs> Dan, you love red breast. I like the twenty seven. A lot. Yeah, it's fantastic. Like a lot. Red breast or green spot? Uh, What's up, Matt? How green spot. Matt opened all of his bottles. Matt Porter. Remember? Oh, yeah. He said they're all safe. Oh, he cor- uncorked them all. Yeah, he I hope he made a video. <laughs> um, um, okay, okay bougie. I look around for some... F- bouge. Wait. Oh, he's got that. Uh, non-bouge. Got it. <gasps> bougie. Barrel seagrass. I'm the best ever at this. Oh, uh, if he likes... He loves But if you like dovetail, he no, won't he like it. but he loves barrel. Yeah. And it's amazing. And it's probably 100 bucks. Damn, I'm really good at this sometimes. It's crazy. Eagle rare. As the cheaper? Non, non-bougie. Okay. What was your bougie again? Jack, Jack Daniels, Daniels single barrel barrel proof. Okay. I feel like we knocked this one out of the park. Yeah. I feel like this is our best I feel one like yet. you need a little Braun Foreman in your life, man. Well, he's got a little. I mean, yeah, he's got a little. He's actually got quite a bit. Mm. More than I thought. Still, you need more. You, you, more. you need better yeah. Braun Foreman. I like double O. I mean, it looks like a store pick, too. So No, that's not. What? Nope. Snort. That's a store pick. Oh, okay. What an idiot. What a knob. Oh, please stop. We're doing Wait. English accents now. Maybe I do a different accent every collection. Yeah, go ahead. 
this won't get racist. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to do Asian what? next. Yeah. Oh, no. And good night, everybody. <laughs> All right. Thank you, James, the man who made Excel, for sending your collection in, buddy. I appreciate it. Okay. Boom. That one. Nailed it. Philip Jorgensen. That is a Vikings name if I've ever heard one. Cheers to North Carolina. Maybe not. <laughs> Wait. <clears throat> what's the rest of his email say? He just said, fan, fan of the channel. Okay. Wants to submit his growing collection. Cool. Being... Featured on an episode Thanks of Collector's Corner. It, buddy. Sent from nine. Do you know what that is? What? Oh, you just blew his shit up. Yeah, I did. No blew one cares. spot up. Don't email Philip Jorgensen. Please don't. Ask him if he's what a Viking. That? And if he is, ask for nudes. What is this? Old Soul. Old Soul is a place that sources whiskey. Sometimes Dickel, sometimes not. So we don't... I don't know what that one is, though. All right. Beautiful label. Yeah. Oh, it keeps going. Ooh. Oh, okay. So we got... We got Wait, some. is that the, uh, the first one? We got oh, some, that's the bottom line. Never we got mind. some bouge in yeah. this collection. Both said you should review my next for getting me killed in Warzone last day. Get some stank, blood oath, <laughs> single barrel straight rye. What's up? Old Chris Reggie, how's it going, nine. buddy? How are you, dude? How's it going, bud? Hopefully you're sleeping more. I hope, hope everything's good, dude, with the babe. <gasps> why is this little baby? Why is this sealed? Good, sir. Maybe he just puts it back in the box. Oh, the Look wax out, looks like say, it's still uh, on it, huh? Old Souls from Mississippi, but the whiskey's not. I don't Rose believe. Creek, Full Proof, Belmede, Sad. This organization looks like Dan made it. There are a lot of sealed bottles here, yep. Chief. Hey. Red Reed Old Tub. Hey, how about uh, we open them? You know and what I mean? Cast Strength something. I don't know what that is. Which one? This one. Broken Barrel. Oh, what it's yeah. Called. I don't know where it's from or anything about it. I just know the label. Nine. He's got an early ten. He's a man of culture. Not open. Woodenville. Nope. None of this is open. 46, some wheat. Oh, He's got a dance chill in there. Oh, there's the Nom Creek 9. Oh, that's an, oh, a small batch select. I thought it was an LE at first. Mm. I was like, ah, no, not see-through. Is there something below that? Or is that the bottom shelf? Is shot? that the Pikesville Oh, he's got something? an old Johnny drum. Yeah. That's so cool. Oh, I thought that was Dant at first. No, that's one of the old drums in the wine bottles. Single malt, Uncle Nearest, Yellowstone, Eagle Rare. That's not a single Bird malt. Dog. You're bad at labels, huh? What's this one? That is just a Kentucky Derby release at Woodford Reserve. Isn't the single malt blue? It's a dark blue. It doesn't have the horse label. That's got the horse label on it. My bad. I just looked at the savant. This the tag here. I'm I'm the label savant. I'm coming back one step at a time. A single barrel. There's stuff down here too. Oh my! Holy shit! There's oh, a wow. lot of stuff. Oh, he's got basil Hayden. Why is it got ECBP on your bottom there? Got a couple buffalo traces. These back are all there. open though. These are I think yeah. almost all of these are open. Sour Mash, Bell Mead, Eagle Rare. This is going to be hard. Angel, okay, two. I hear it all over the place. He's got that rise. That's Brandon Robinson, riff. it's because we have about 400 in our inbox, buddy. That's that's the actual yep. reason, if it makes you feel any better. Nom Creek Rye Pick. Can't tell the age. <laughs> I think all the rise are like four to five. Yeah. Five to six, something like that. All right! Wow, your collection's a little bit everywhere. I like it. I oh, enjoy it. It's he has seemingly everything. A little bit of everything. Yeah, that's gonna be rough. Um, Can you go back to the very top for me? Yes. Stag Junior. I'm gonna I'm gonna make an assumption that he likes Sazerac because all this Sazerac is on his top shelf. There's no Heaven Hill up there except the old fits. He keeps the ECVP on the bottom shelf in the cabinet. I mean, I get it. I need whiskey. Uh, there's a sh there's some on the wall. I need whiskey, Dan. You know, I was told that this is underrated today. By who? Matt. Porter? Yeah. Why were you talking to Matt Porter? He put out his video. Oh, did you comment on it? No. Why were you talking to him? I was. I said I was told by Matt Porter today. Oh, yeah. Watch his video he didn't today. tell you that. No, he told the world that. Matt Porter. All right, I got my bougie bottle. Matt he Porter also said you shouldn't ever buy, and these are his exact words, you should never, no matter what, buy an old force or single barrel barrel proof. And that's a quote. You can quote me on the quote unquote. Okay. Um, it's not a quote, by the way, just so everybody knows. Not quote unquote. Before Matt, like, sues me, comes after us. Um, for defamation of character. Man, he literally has everything. I don't even know what no, to recommend. No, he does not have everything. It feels that way, though. What's up, Night Angel? How's it going, buddy? You're a baby. 
Do you have guesses already? I've guesses? got my bougie. Jesus, please. Is Sean not allowed to talk to Matt Porter? I just, it's weird if he does. <laughs> Here's a quote. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. Only Zachary said fire Sean so far today. So I'm... far. There's time, though. There's time. <laughs> a lot of time. Okay, I got a bougie. Me too. What's your bougie? Uh, four gate. The, the ruby. <laughs> okay. Memory effect. Um, I mean, we talked about it, and I said I'm definitely going to uh, give it to someone tonight, and this feels like a good... G- g- I just died. Good collection for... <laughs> Holy shit. Maybe I don't need whiskey. Turned you know into what? fucking goofy for a second. I feel like the Terminator just throat punched me. <laughs> um, Woo! So I'm going to recommend... Send it to... Old Bird Carter... Jack. Batch eight bourbon. Wow. I mean, you don't have any. It fits. He has no old Carters. Yep. And it fits really well price range wise on that top shelf. So that's my bougie. Okay. My, where does he, did he say where he was from or no? North Carolina. Shit. North Carolina. Shit. I'm working on the cheap bottle. This one's rough. Don't I say a lot? Oh, okay. I got my cheaper. Do you? Yep. Give me a second. Easy. You said, you get everything. I know. Don't and then, and fucking then, and do that and say you easy. You're taking a long time. you taking a long time? Yeah, you okay? Hey, Terminator. <laughs> yeah, that one hurt. Um, Yellow corn, Steve Damron said. My lord. <laughs> Drew Fearsome, thanks for hanging out, buddy. Appreciate it, man. I... I don't even know what to get this man as a cheap bottle. Oh, that's weird. You were just giving me What's shit yours, about that. What's yours, bitch? What is it? Yeah. Lost Monarch. I figured you'd go with that eventually. Eventually? You got to wait till somebody doesn't have... He's got almost all the starter whiskeys, right? The you beginners? He's got all the beginner whiskeys out. Out here chilling. Like yeah. all of them. So that's when you got to get a little craft with it. Just a little hint of craft. Chattanooga 111. There you go. You're welcome. Did Heath Harvey say Lost Monarch in chat? Yeah, a lot of people did. That's hilarious. Okay, but three cups. Dan, what did you throw a bug at me? No. Okay, switch it back so people can see our beautiful faces. What's up? How are you guys doing? I didn't throw a bug. I at swear to God, one time I just want to come back, and that's just I'm a completely different. We're just not here. Yeah. <laughs> chat one eleven is really good. Man needs some scotch. It's hard to recommend scotch to people who don't have any scotch. Cheers, Abby. How are the shirts holding up? Chino. They're fantastic. They make great shirts, man. Okay, we got Jeff. I just read your last name and I already forgot it. Start with oh them. It's like Marrier. Gosh. Marrier. Jeff Marrier. <laughs> <laughs> He's got basils. <laughs> okay, I like this. A little American Prairie. We can scratch that bottle. Um, Ejel Rail. Buffalo Drake. Okay, a lot of... Are these all sealed, buddy? Yeah, What's going like, on here? What is this? What is this? It's got M. Is that brandy or something? Yeah, like that, I think that it's that VSOP, weird yeah. on the top. Oh, that, oh, oh that. Sean poured. Boone County single barrel seven-year weeded. That's what Matt said okay. was underrated. Should open this up. Oh, that's an old Knob Crate yeah. store pick. That's kind of cool. These are like 175s, bud. Look how big they are. They don't make 175s of foolproof, so you'd be wrong, sir. I don't know about that. Chat. Look how them. big that bottle is. Chat, like, let them. me zoom out. Look how big that fucking bottle is. That's a 175 of Eagle Rare, if I've ever seen one. I mean, it's next to that old Forester and dominating it. Now, look how big it is next to that. Those are 175s. Those are not 175s. They have to be. They didn't even make those Knob Creek store picks in 175s. It might be a shorter shelf. Dude, it or looks a higher shelf. huge. That's what she said. Like... Oh, Tennessee Honey used to be my jam. Maybe it is just the distortion on yeah, that. It's like, not distortion. It's your eyes shitty. Those are not 175s. Well, Ceiling, Scott, I'm out of here. Bye. Me. Another um, American Prairie. Oh, stop. Bro, I, oh, he got tricked in the Basil Hayden. And I feel like the American Prairie is a trick, too, honestly, at this point. Small batch? Must be. Mixters? 
That looks so sad. That's a regular Eagle Rare. Look at it next to the High West. Yeah, that's when I realized. I was like, dude, I didn't think they were that much taller than 1920s. I think it's just a perspective thing. Apparently. Idiot. Yeah, fuck me, right? Now they're a rare breed. Wait, Sean are these not the first? Eyes. What's that bottom stuff? Go back, down. Caribou? Oh, that's the Gila. That's the Gila. Maybe. Blood Oath Pack 6. Okay. Looks like a 6. Jack Daniels of something. I know how many we got here. Oh, okay. God damn it. Bullet, Larceny. Even those bottom bottles look huge. Wait, those are 175s. Are you sure? Yeah. Look at how far away the bullet words are from the label. Look at how little that blood off yeah. the of that thing. So there's the 175s you were looking for. They definitely didn't make a You move that Eagle Rare thing. out. Does that not look fucking store huge, pick. though? What is this I mean, camera? It kind of does. Man. Is this shot on I'm a fucking GoPro? Honest. It kind of does. This is a GoPro. <laughs> now we see why you lost to Will Birdhouse BMX. Said. Oh, <laughs> my gosh. Any day you want to get in the ring. <laughs> people blind against you. Yeah, this is the thing, dude. People, you know, I said that last week and you said, me, 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 me. What are you, okay. I got a, I got a cheapo. Okay, let me. Do you think this person smokes cigars? So are these, what these are, are all like doing? the same shelves over and yeah, over. Yeah, just go to the picture that shows all of them. It's just close-ups. Yeah. Zoom out a little. Burp. There we go. Okay. That is an old ass Knob Creek pick, man. That really is. This is the new blue or gold dress. <laughs> One seven five or not? <laughs> um. All right. I have a cheaper bottle to purchase. Bougie Ooh, price but. range. I guess that Blood Oath was 100 No. Blood Oaths are literally $100, all of them. They've oh, all I think been. It was 90. I don't know. I'm arguing over $10. But yeah, also we'll true. Um, so 100 bucks ish Okay. Um, is the top. I'm Okay, I have both. I'm good at I'm just It's insane. You know? It's one of those things. Okay, I've got one. Cheaper. Are you changing shirts? What are you doing over there? I was going to. Damn. No, I can't. I was going to come back in a different shirt every time we cut, and Sean fucking ruined it. I... All right. I got mine. Do you have yours yet? Yeah. You good? No. Don't cut it. Oh, my God, my eyes. Cheapo. Uh, Old Forest 100. Double rye. Okay. Killed about five ounces of it last night. It's pretty good. Mine expensive? Mine expensive. Fuck. You're an idiot tonight. ECBP. Uh, My expensive is... Oh, no. Oh, Woodford Batchproof. Oh, okay. 120 bucks, but fantastic. Probably, I think I like Woodford Batch Roof mo- uh, more than most of the bottles in this collection. How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, so. Thank you, Jeff. Mary. Mary. As they call him. How long are we going to do this for? Does it feel like we've been doing it forever? It's I mean, it's been like eleven. A half an hour. No, but we haven't. We didn't start this at nine. Ten. It's eleven. We've been doing this an hour. We have not, have we? So blurry. Why? I don't know why. You tell me. Is it actually? Okay, this is not his fucking. I can't wait to rip this one. Yep, small but growing collection. We're going to talk about this, Mike W. Wait, wait, wait. You let see me that read, middle? Let, yeah, let me read the rest of that. Small but growing collection. Interesting. We'll do Ivan's, too. Okay. After this. Okay. Which which picture? Ivan sent us three. We'll do this one first, and then we'll do Ivan's. Okay. This is... This is the collection? There's just a Georgie fucking stag chilling in the middle? And a Mictress 10 and a Blands and an ECBP. 
Hold on. The four. That's an 18 or 19. Which one was the one? Was the low. Yeah, nine, or Wait, okay. So four of his si- seven bottles are what the most people would call very hard to find. Yeah. Now, Wild Turkey 101 clearly isn't. You know what I wish? I wish that the Wild Turkey 101, the Woodford, and the Makers weren't open. Okay. He just had those three bottles. Got my cheap one. Okay. Me too. Buffalo Trace. Eagle Rare. <laughs> I mean, shit. What do you want me to say in that yeah, collection? Eagle Rare. There we go. Tapless <laughs> uh, well, Dog said, I could spin kick this guy. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic. The first uh, one reviewed was 38 minutes ago. Feels like forever. It well, we've been ripping through them. We've yeah. done a lot already, which is probably why it feels. Um, like. bougie. All right, I got one. Will you hand me that octopus torch, please, sir? Um, bougie. I mean, that stag was. Let's call it stag one fifty. Yeah. I don't know when he bought it. A couple years ago, maybe. Maybe he got lucky. Yeah. Mictors is at least a one twenty bottle. Minimum. Yeah. So. so the the good news is about this collection, you can say about anything. Yeah, it kind of fits everything, huh? Fucking anything. M20. <laughs> okay, robot. Victor Celebration, what did you say? Um, Three emails and 15 pictures. All right, Ivan, we'll do you next. And that's the end of her. Literally nobody has left. There's Good. still 650 people. In Thanks here. for being here, guys. These like, are fun. People like this. Papskis. <laughs> I don't know why it's felt like we've done 1,000 right now. Hey, do you have your, your bougie? I'm not done. Okay. What you do with the other fucking lighter? Lighters. There's nine of them in the hut. It's literally a giant silver one in front of your dumb face. Yep. Like I thought I set that strange. down earlier. You did, actually. Um, my bougie. We, bottle killed the Mictors 10 this weekend. Okay. Nice. Bottle killing unobtainable bottles is fun. I don't know why, but it's fun. My bougie's Stag Jr. Oh, no, he, he said he just one. got. Okay, he said he just got a Stag Jr., yeah, to add to this collection, you got to stay junior, guys. So My bougie is Obtanium. It's $60. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. It doesn't fucking matter. Hold on. And you can buy it on, like, fucking Haskell's and stuff. Buy it. Online. It, um, it doesn't matter. My bougie. There's, like, eight bottles there. Seven. My bougie is a... Bardstown Discovery 4, actually. There's or no. three, but whichever. Because I think it's better than everything there except the Mictors 10. Or, sorry, except the George C. Stag. That just adding some light whiskey into the collection. No, that's fair. It's just I would went with that with the cheaper bottle. Eh. Five of those seven were at least 60. Your bougie bottle costs as much as... <clears throat> okay, my bougie bottle is uh, Blue Run. Oh, that's a good one. I don't think you can find it anymore, but it's a good uh, one. Oh, oh, yeah, okay. Where are we going to be at with this? Now it's a mystery. Nobody knows what shirt I'm going to be wearing when they come back. That's kind of fun. It's like a maybe I will, maybe I won't. You know what I mean? And that's on. I feel like it's just not running. It's not. I is, can hear it. Is it on like three? No, but you can hear the air conditioner. Seven. Now it's on. Now it's on. You just turned up four. No, one. No. It was on six. I, I swear to God, it was on six. finger tappers. Okay. You can I'm finger tap you, you piece of shit. <laughs> okay, move that. Move that. Who one was Move that? that. Move that. Which one was Mike it? Mike W. Oh, yeah. I started. Jesus. Mike Wazowski. Okay, go to the top. We got to do Ivan's fucking go museum of collection. Assuming it's a lot. Why are there so many fucking bugs in here? I don't know, man. I really can't figure it out. We got to oh. be careful with this mess. Holy shit, Ivan. What? There's Ivan, no- what? <laughs> Kyle S. said, we're going to come back and Dan won't have a shirt on. And that is when I leave the stream. <laughs> okay, let me... Uh, or you're just happier, you know? Who knows? Are these all the same thing, Ivan? Report fishing is what I'm about to do to your ass. <laughs> These are all the same. Ivan, why did you send so many? I think they're just different angles. Ivan, why did you do what you did? You read chat. I'm <laughs> reading chat. Okay. I'm looking for Ivan's response. Because I feel like this is all the same shit, right? Mike Wazowski is the guy from Monsters, Inc. I had to unload three angles. cabinets and a hutch. Why did you send three emails with 72 pictures? 
Holy oh my shit. god, Ivan. Oh my god. All right. We're in for the long haul, motherfuckers. <laughs> this is the last one for goddamn oh, sure. Oh. Make sure. Okay. okay. All right. Here we go. Now you're seeing what we're seeing. Fucking everything ever made. Lots of Sazerac. Um. Uh, holy mother effer. Hopefully that's our new riff. I don't see our sticker on it. There's a couple new riffs there. Midwinters, Eagle Rare, Sam Houston's, Bowman. There's just a fucking casual WLW chilling there like it ain't a goddamn thing. Waller. Kosher Rise. Kosher Wheat. All the Koshies. Blood Oath. I, okay. So there are literally 15 pictures. I think that's Lost Monarch with the blue cork top or whatever. Well, here, let's find out if it's in the next picture. <laughs> this is slightly to the left of the first picture. Zachary Jones had Budget Island. <laughs> <laughs> that's top down. I don't know if that's a... Is that not a mythology bottle, but no, that's the wrong not. cork? Yeah. Oh. I don't, know bottle. What, I don't know what the 040 is. Oh, we got a bullet pick. <sighs> Russell's pick. Old I Forster, actually bunch have of Knob Creek picks, some wilderness some trail, some blood oaths over there, Oak and Eden, smoke wagons, some Jeffersons, fucking a Ivan. He's got one of those pork lag or whatever. Jeffersons. There. Let's see what the next fucking picture is. Oh, it's slightly to the right of that one. Oh, there's the new rendezvous rye. Oh yeah, midwinters, eagle rare, the chicken cock. They have cool looking bottles. Ocean. And unopened oceans. Rent house. <laughs> Ivan, why don't you open some of these? Is that a Shanks or a Bomb Burgers? It's one of the two, isn't it? Um, Maybe not. Maybe they don't have a neck tag? It's just that bottle? That's what I thought it was. It's the Sam Houston Calumet bottle? Maybe? Someone tell me what that is. Yeah, I think that's the Sam Houston. Or Cal- that's a Calumet, I think. I mean, that's a, yeah. right there, that's Sam Houston. Yeah, that's a Calumet. Okay. Um. Ooh, Caribou Crossing. Are there scotches in here? I don't see any. So this is the back side of the first little bit. Okay. That's the back side of the WLW. So yeah. Okay. So we want to look over here because I can. This man. Ivan. All right. Okay. Next picture. That's the last of them. He sent forty-two emails. Yeah, we'd have to go to the next email. Holy shit. Yeah, so this is the, the front side. So we already did a 360 around. <laughs> um, it's Calumet? All right. Are the other pictures different bottles? I don't know. Ivan, you in here? I can't check without going back. Going back? Yeah, we can go back. Okay. Just drink some, don't add anything. Well, a lot, almost all those were open. So, I, it's just same island. Okay. Different angles? Yep. Okay. Oh. Nope, that's the wrong thing. That's that. Same thing I've been <laughs> signed out. Okay. I don't Slide like that juniors. there's one kosher over here and then the other two are over here. Other than that, we're <laughs> that's good. bothering you. Yep. <laughs> um,. I can't even keep straight everything he's fucking got. Hmm. Yeah. Man, what? That's that's the problem is I feel like I'm just gonna recommend something he already. Uh, yeah, I can't see it. Okay. So hear me out. I feel like I didn't see a lot of 1792 products in there. Um, I saw some of the gold court caps, but I don't know what. Is there only one email on this one? Or did we already? Okay, um. they're all down here. Oh. I definitely haven't seen this angle. Um, makers, 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 bookers, M10. Another M10. You know what I'd recommend for uh, the cheaper one. Oh, oh fuck okay. me. Where's these more, coming from? More bottles. Okay, I got a cheapo. I got a cheap one. There's another email. 
Okay. I got a cheap one. I just heard a rabbit air starting, Alex said. <laughs> yep. Shh. Sean just got up and turned it on. OFBB's oh, there chilling they are. there. There's the golden. I saw the golden caps. Oh, it. yep. There they are. I knew it. Bunch of. All right. Um, man, a bougie one. Holy F. All right. I got my bougie. What's your bougie? Uh, Four Roses Ellie. Okay. I didn't see a single Four Roses Ellie right. in there. It's safe, though. <laughs> Thad said, recommend a shelf. Steve said, <laughs> I recommend a nice liquor cabinet. He said that he had to clean his island off to put them all on the island so he could take pictures for us. I, so then okay. I'm assuming he put them Do you back. know how big the island is in my kitchen? Right, yeah. Could you imagine putting all the bottles in the hut on that thing, though? Wouldn't fit. I no Literally way. would not fit. Yeah. Impossible. Physics wouldn't exist. Someone told us that. One of the comments. We should look into physics. I said, oh, I read your response. I Which laughed. part of it? I laughed. <laughs> You're like, I don't think you understand how this works. <laughs> there's, there's a couple like, parts of it. Can you explain this to me? And right. then his explanation was horrendous. I oh, could have done a, a better job. There was one back? I missed it? Oh, oh he I'm was have to find it. Oh, buddy, it's so bad. He used words I've never, I don't think are real. Like, for real. I don't feel like I have too many bottles now. Yeah, Jerry. I, I don't feel that way either. Um, okay. I got my cheaper so one. I, I don't have my four roses one. back there, but I didn't see an LE. Um... Recommend shelves. There's more picks. All right. Jerry Black, thanks for the super chat. Come yeah. back. There's more? Yeah. yeah. The I, 30 I need, to, I need to think of an... Oh, I got an expensive one. Easy. Figure it out. You even said sorry on this one. What are we missing here? Okay, I have both of mine now. Haven't seen either of the bottles I'm going to recommend. Me either. All right. My expensive one is Old Carter Rye 5 or 6. Batch 5 or 6, which you can buy, like, Blade and Bow cheap. That's a good cheap one. I didn't think about that. So, uh, and Old Carter Rye would be my recommendation. My cheap one. I don't have a cheap one. Is the up-and-coming... Bourbon Junkie Starlight pick. That's how I know he doesn't have it. It's not out yet. That'd be my recommendation. He's got the four Roselli. Motherfucker. Well, Sean's bad at this. All right, my uh, my expensive one is George G. Stag. Didn't see one of those. You got a, you know, WLW chilling there. You got one of those? Maybe? Cheap one? Mother effer. You went with a bottle that doesn't even exist to us yet either, bud. Yeah, but we drank it. Okay, but it doesn't even exist to us, bud. And if you got George G. Stagg, then I picked the Jim Beam uh, <laughs> Distiller <laughs> Select. You're, you're picking them in case he has it already. Um, what? All right, hand me uh, the, the order. Okay, 35 people said he doesn't have an early times bottle to bond. Okay, but I can't recommend that because it's going away. But it's not away. It's going I, away. So I, you and I talked on a live stream. What? Between the Yamazaki and the Frey Ranch. That's, I'm going to pull the stream back, and I'm going to be holding that, and that's what I'm going to tell him to get for oh his cheap gosh. bottle. That might be harder to find than early times <laughs> bottle than bond right now. Yeah. Boom. Virgin bourbon. It's fantastic. You'll really enjoy it. <laughs> Eric Thompson said, can you just form that pick so I can show it to the next person that tells me I have a problem? <laughs> <laughs> oh, good call. Meet up at Ivan's. Fair. Good point. So, okay, Joe said that early times bottle and bond is in one of those pictures. No, yeah, it was. It's not. It's No, I don't think it's opened. Okay. Hey, will you grab me a Coke Zero out of there, dude? Really? Yeah. Are you kidding me right now? That'd be amazing right now. It doesn't hurt my chest, you know? God, you're a pussy. I know. I agree. You want some virgin bourbon? <laughs> Brewed for you. <laughs> what do you mean by going away? People are upset by your statement. It's going away. It's going away. They, uh... 
put a new label through the TTB. It's going to Barton. Sazerac bought it. It's going under the Barton. It will label. go under the Barton portfolio. It will be what did they say? Blended light whiskey. Is uh, I don't know the if that's label. been confirmed or not. I don't know. I mean, that, that label has gone through the TTB as early times. That they're changing the label of the cheap early times. Yeah. Like the one we don't buy. Yeah. That the brown label. One? Yeah. yeah. They're changing that label. That's been approved. Okay. The new, all, all we know about the new early times bottled and bond, it's going to be a Barton product. That's all we know right now. Yes. There's not been a TTB label approved for the no. bottled and bond. So. Um, it won't be around. Florida sucks. Can't wait on my road trip to Missouri to stop at every store on the way and hopefully find some gems. Oh, dude. When you just Slum have trip. like a bunch of extra time and you can just stop at a nice liquor store, every liquor store you see on your way, that's the best, dude. Normal early times is already light whiskey. Yeah, no. it's not bourbon. The normal one's not bourbon. But it's bottled in bond? I no, the normal it... one isn't bottled in bond, buddy. Oh, okay, yeah. He's talking about the, sorry, the, normal the shitty yeah, like $10 like, one. You can't do that. That's that's literally against. Bottled in bond light whiskey, what? I, yeah, I was what like, uh, that's not how that works. What are um, you saying? Yeah, I would definitely buy, if you're, you're thinking about it, buy a couple bottles of early times bottle and bond, because it's eventually going to run out and turn into a new product. Well, yeah, eventually the... the the source in which the whiskey came from yeah. is going to be gone. It's not going to be made by Brown. Like, that source won't be Brown mm. Foreman, so. Which is unfortunate. Do you like High Noon? Yes, I do like High Noon. They're good. Dan loves it. Um, I had the best seltzer I've ever had in my life. What was his name? At Klein's. <laughs> it was um, Untitled Arts or whatever. Remember that one I brought in the tall boy can? No. Sean's all over the place every day of the week, Jonathan Bingle. This is, that's just the mind of Sean. You know, it just is. I know HBR put into my blend. It's going to be good. Is it? Yeah. Oh, I do. oh no. You don't know what's gone into yours. No, I don't know what David Kira put in. I never even thought about it until you said you knew what HBR put into it. Oh fuck, my night's ruined. Wait, my you didn't completely ask? Completely ruined. It's completely. It's ruined. on stop four, and you haven't asked it's what people have put into your shit yet. Completely ruined. I told him to mark it down on the sheet and pass it on to the next person. Oh, I, I built, I had a logo made. I built a whole sheet out. Everybody fills out the sheet and then passes the sheet on with it. So everybody knows what came before it, basically. Yeah, I just have a thread going on that people are just going to say what they put in there. We'll see. Well, we're one for one. Two for two, if you count me. Two for two. Well, actually, you're two, two for three because you don't know Matt's. What is this thing not doing tonight? I mean, I it's just giving up. Why? It hates its life. Uh, there's probably like a squirrel nest in the damn thing. Or a squirrel. Just a squirrel in it. Just ah, dead. I'll get in there later. Toshi Bake, if you have over 200 bottles and you don't actually do anything related to bourbon professionally, do you have a problem? Asking for a friend. I don't think so. Nope. No, because hobbies are hobbies, buddy. Yeah. Hobbies are hobbies. So that is max. I can feel an air draw with that thing right now. I know. Can you guys, is it super loud for you guys? It looks pretty loud. Is it loud for you guys? New Air won't be sponsoring though? Why not? Noise gates aren't on, but if we just tip it down a little bit, you're tipped up. Turn the noise gates on. Why? That's loud as shit. It's not that loud. Some people said it's okay. There goes the fucking audio quality. Look how much that Oh, dude, out. the noise gate is oh, not a joke. Holy shit. Okay. That un, our Untitled Art Seltzer is there. It's a good one. I got the Fruit Medley. Woo! Dude, that Fruit Medley one, mind you, it's like 250 calories yeah. in a tall boy. Okay, it's that thing amazing. is fucking ripping right now. It's doing fantastic. I can literally it's feel a, the cold air from the... Me too. Coming over here now. Yeah. It feels nice. <laughs> it's, a, it's a lot of draw. It feels nice. I think at max, it's 400 cubic feet a minute. Really? Yeah, I think so. Um, so, at Max, we should have a couple turnovers per... Oh, speaking of a nice turnover. You ever had a pair one? Yep. Idiot. Oh, my gosh, Jason. Can't read it out loud. Yep. <laughs> Actually funny, though. Yep. What the fuck? Who are these guys? Well, Joel Bagley, I don't know how did you get here, you know? You tell us who we are, and then we'll Just tell you... Guys you having if we agree time. with you or not, we'll start with that. For real, how'd you get here, though? Um, they had one called Pixie Sticks or something. Was it amazing, Jamie? 
is OFC bourbon 1995 worth 3,300 Canadian and double eagle very rare 2,500 Canadian. That's like no money. Uh, I mean, I'd rather go for the double eagle at that point. I mean, it's almost a thousand dollars cheaper, and what? I've not had it. Twenty five hundred dollars Canadian is that like a thousand bucks? Nope. Fifty bucks? No nope. shit. A little higher. For real? How much is that? Can't hear you. Whom? How much is that? How much is that in Canadian? A thousand dollars? No, no, no. How much is twenty five hundred dollars in U.S. dollars in oh, Canadian? Oh, probably money? like. 22, 2300. No, it's not that close. It's not that big of a difference. Hey, Google. Dude. Okay. This thing's a piece of shit. How many US dollars is 2,500 Canadian dollars? 2,000. Okay. Fuck. Canada money's worth more than I thought. Yeah. Well, interesting. Like, did you think it was. Like, a peso? What are we looking at here? Somebody said, can you even buy eagle with Canadian dollar hairs? <laughs> That's too much like America. We did your collection a little while ago, buddy. Yeah. I hope you didn't miss it. If you did, I feel like I did better than Sean, but I don't remember. You know what I mean? Hot Barry Roll said, I'm on my way to Canada. Yeah, that's the thing. In Mid or in Midland, in Michigan, in Michigan, in the United States, fourth tries a charm. In the United States of America, you'll never find it at that price ever. At retail. Never. We what, saw one as a trophy. What did you say about June the other day on Friday? It was like... The, I forgot the month orders. Yeah, you said the first June of the month or something like that. No, like, I no, no. I did forget the other day that August and September were in the order they were in. I thought they were switched. I'm not fucking with you either. I literally forgot. I thought oh. it went July, September. And it doesn't. So, pretty soon USD will be about half a Canadian dollar, probably. Did <sighs> arms come with that shirt? No. Hence, you see what you get. Oh, no. Right. Are you not impressed? <laughs> That's all I got. So if you're not, I'm sorry. Oh, this is good. All right, hold on. Do one more collection. All right. Look for bows. Uh, like. When do you send it? Probably today. Zachary Jones is in here. Again. He sent it. It literally says, this is the only thing I have that's small. There's only one picture. I'm that's it. funny. Is this both? Yeah. No, this is Zachary Jones. That, we already did his. We did his right off the rip. He sent us an updated collection picture. You said, that table's a budget table. Remember? It's just in a different location. Yep. Delete this one. This is oh, one. yeah. Yeah. He's got the thick. All right. There's also two super chats. So read them. I can't. I'm fucking... I can, no, I, I really can't. They're not on the screen. I would have literally read them, but they weren't on the screen. Go ahead. Hot Boy Rolls just said, help Dan achieve his dream of not having to know months anymore. Patreon.com slash bourbon junkies. <laughs> I, I love you. I love you, buddy. I'm Andrew Lynn with Super Chat. I appreciate you guys. I appreciate you, guy. Can you just search for him? How are you doing? Yeah. Search Mike. Uh, Go ahead. Just type Mike. Working on the Kirkland with Mike Bobes. Jamie, what? Jamie, what? What hmm. are you doing, Jamie? Eric, we are smoking Alec Bradley cigars. Mine is a Niga Puro Lancero, which I love. I don't think they sell those. Yes, they do. You can buy them online. We have this conversation every time oh, we yeah. have them. And then you have to buy them from a specific site, but yes. you can buy them online. Uh, and then he's got a Kintsugi from Alec and Bradley. Both of them. Not just one. But both. There you go. This is both. Both check. All right. Barrel proof, barrel proof. Holy. Disco something. That's Labad. Labadu. La Scooby Doo. I'm a brand new sub and I got rewarded with the live stream. You guys are awesome. JL Lopez. Hey, Jennifer. Is that you? J Lo? She's back with Ben Affleck. She is? Yeah. He's a good looking dude. Talking. Um, thanks for being here. Appreciate it. Oh, Hope the sag more. Time. Okay. A sag more? Yeah, look. A sag less. Dig, dig, dig. Get it? I feel like I nailed 14. that joke. Um, Small batch, oh, single barrel. Oh, got some hitters, huh? Damn. Barrel okay. roof. Wow. What Unopened. Call, what you call this? Budget? Oh, no, it no, is. I'm sorry. Not. You hater. Okay, I saw right there. You're a hater. It looks unopened from that angle. 
Sometimes I feel weird finding you guys so much fun, but then I realize it's not Greek talking. <laughs> <laughs> Very fine. Rare. Toasted barrel finish. This is what else? What's that? What else we got? Scroll down. Okay. Bring me down to New York City where the grass Before is green and the girls are pretty. Uh, is that the rendezvous? Which one? This one? No, that's double rye. Double rye? Is that the new one, though? They didn't redo double rye. That's a store pick. Oh, that's what it is. Genius me. Um, what, all, what, what are the two new ones that they did? What? They redid the rendezvous rye label, and that was it. I thought they did two. They made the burr rye uh, distillery only. Mm. That's, pro- that's probably what you're thinking of. Um, and then they he got said, rid of Yippie Kaye. <sighs> Which... Okay, we got a lot of Sazerac. So Blanton's, Weller, yeah. Kosher, Hancock. Yeah, kosher, I don't know which one. Lots of uh, Sazerac on the right side of that shelf down there. I think there. this is the only pick. All the Saz. Oof. 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 One of the best bottles come out of last year. What's that? The rye? Single barrel rye. So good, man. The Jack Yaniel single barrel it rye. so damn good. Oh, yeah, look. It's uh, Glen Eastwood. Sticker. Good, the bad, the ugly. Oh, what bottle is that? That's the High West. It's a, no it's a mirror. It's the back oh, of the is? High West. Look, it's right there. Oh, the cork just looks weird in the mirror. Oh, it's because yeah. the cork's through the oh, bottom. Tormentor, 38, said, power's back. I'm back. Hell yeah, dude. Glad your power's back. Hopefully, Dan said Hancock. Back. Yep, that's what he says. Yeah. What do you call it? Hancock. Hancock? It's not Hancock. a team, it. Hand? Hand. Cock. No D. And the cock. cock. Okay. <laughs> this is Bo's got some hitters. Wow. Like a lot of hitters, honestly. Yeah. Old Force single barrel barrel proof back yeah. there. A lot of proof and a lot of really good bottles. Like it's not like these aren't these I would call these show and go bottles. Because it's not just like, oh my gosh, I gotta. B-Tac. It's like, I got fucking monsters all over the place, dude. Uh-huh. Um, shit. I okay, gonna, I got I'm my bougie. I'm going to suggest a bougie I've already suggested tonight. Old Carter American? I was going to go Old Carter Bourbon. Okay. i go 8 or 10. And I haven't had 10, so take that with a grain of salt, but I heard 8 and 10 were the best. I loved 8. Yeah. So I, I already agreed with half of the statement. Very good. So, um, okay. Well, we both said an Old Carter. <laughs> right. I said the American. He said uh, Bourbon. You can't go wrong with the Americans either. The American old Carters. Yeah. Um, wait, both didn't CJ send you a sample of old Carter? No, we did. I sent you a sample of old Carter and the sample that Joe, whatever. Did you like the old Carter? Or no. Cause this will really answer a question for us pretty much live. I literally recommended the old Carter that I sent. you. <laughs> <laughs> did you like it or not really? He said, I do need Old Carter. A cheap one? I feel like we can even do like a nice 50 to 60 range on the cheapo, you know? I feel like you have to. I kind of like that. Um, fuck. Oh, uh, I, I would say if, if we wanted to go something that was different than uh, Old Carter, yeah. I would say the... Um, yep, Murray Hill. Yeah. The Murray Hill, the barrel proof one. How did you know from me doing this? A little circle around yep. that. Yeah, the special release. Well, it, it makes sense because yeah. it fits the barrel-proof aspect. It's a really good bottle of whiskey. Yeah. And, like you said, it's not the old Carter, but. Yeah. Um, Get out of my head, Dan. Um, I live in there rent-free, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, am I losing oh. Fridays right now? Yeah. Shit. Two to one. And we've only done one. All right, I got my non-bougie. Easy. Easy. This is so easy. Fuck, it's right there. You're going to do Russell's pick? Yep. No, just a Russell's uh, oh, okay. red label. I'm going to say from a non-bougie. Fuck. Uh, I got to remember, I both's, in, both's somewhere in Tejas. So. I, yeah, he's got Weller. I'm going to say. Uh, how much is the, the Rebel Yell 10-year? I don't think you can find it. I don't know if they still make it even. Oh. If you can find it, it's supposed to be like 80 or 60 or 100 range. 60 to 100. <laughs> it's such a big fucking range. I know. It, dude, it's supposed to be somewhere between 20 and $500. You know what I mean? Give or take. So Okay. On any given day, depending on the state. 
You know what you need oh, in your okay. life? Oh, okay. said that was LED lights on the bottles, not sun. Okay. okay. What I he needs my is the Knob Creek 920 proof. For real. He doesn't have any. The 9 year 120 proof? Yeah. It's good. I made a face. Yeah, I saw that. For you those of you who no can't one see thought. me. We like that bottle. Uh, excuse me. We like that bottle. Don't make faces. I got it. Boom. Got it. Got a cheapo. Go ahead. Obtainium. Not the hazmat, though. <gasps> no. You could say four nope. roses, single barrel nope. at this point in time. Ready? Cheapo. Nassif Family Reserve. Okay. They're 40 bucks. I love them. They're light whiskey. They're 107 proof. Matt's is fucking amazing. Maker's 46 cast strength. Or the Maker's oh, Limited. Oh, that's a good one. Maker's like Limited that. would be good, too. I would go... I personally the like FAE the FAE 1 so. is really good. The cast strength's good. I'm hoping. I've got high hopes for the FAE 02 this year. A lot of that bottom shelf tormentor is store picks. Yeah. So. Woodford very fine. Well, he had the bat yeah. proof up top. I don't know. I don't. I just. It's hard to recommend the very fine. It's got to be kind of like a specific collection for me, I feel like. <laughs> so my table's made out of solid OSB. Who's budgeting now? That's true. Well, a, a sheet of OSB several right now hundreds of dollars for is both there. Fucking Third gold. Gosh. All right. I see the, a slab it. of OSB, and I'm like, you know, who got who hit the lottery? How did you find that? Trade some. I'm telling you, it's, crack it's, it's the new diamond market. They've got all the the wood. They're just holding them back. Got the same as in 15. It's great. Good job on your input. Well. Nice. Uh, Abby said, any yet. idea when we'll see FAO 2? Love the FAO 1. Nope. Uh, there is a, I think it was supposed to be October. Um, oh, thanks for sending your Because it was supposed to be spring and fall. I want to say, I was just looking at that calendar not long ago. I thought it was October. But I'm not 100% on that. Which one did I just move? Have they developed tater sticks for plywood yet? Yeah. Lowe's is all over that. It's a what sticker that says about thirty four ninety nine. Two by four? Is that what you're talking about? Holy shit. Do you know how much a two by four is right now? Eight bucks. Eight thirty eight. Yeah, that's crazy. I bought a bunch when it was six dollars. Cause I was like, fuck, I just I need to have some right. wood around here for projects and shit like that. And my stepdad's like, oh, all right, cool. Bought a bunch, like probably fifteen extra more than I needed on anything. Now they're eight dollars. Apparently, I could just I could flip lumber at this point in time. We should. <laughs> oh, it's supposed to come back down soon. Yeah, okay. it's supposed to start trending down. I should say it should. It's not supposed to be like back to like two dollars. I watched a guy in front of me buy a bunch of deck board and go, oh, "Fuck, wow." We were talking about this that much, night. huh? Apparently, right now, deck board is more expensive. September, okay. Than the plastic deck. Yeah. You can build like the forever decking for less money right now than you can build a wooden deck, which is insane. Yeah, I would do that. Which part? The wood? Just build a fucking plastic deck. Here's shit. the problem we need to build a more deck, and we already built a wood deck. Who cares? You so can't attach a plastic deck. You can. It. it would look It'll so stupid. It would be fine. It would look so dumb. It'll be fine. Yeah. This is from Chino. Matt said. Anywhere in your NASA one? Not yet. Uh, waiting on barrel sourcing things right now. Matt. Clean case. Um, all of it. Put any more thought into the barrel head for pay? What does that mean? Put any more thought into the barrel head I for I put paper. lots of thought into it. They're done. Yeah. Um, but what are, you, what are you referencing, Matt? Paint over all of it after it's done. Just paint it like wood. Stain it. The plastic deck. You just rip it up and just put plastic deck on top of it. it. Fuck it. Um, right now, steel framing is cheaper than lumber. Yeah. I know that's so crazy. Just build out of concrete. I reached out a, for, to another pole barn place about a quote today. We'll <sighs> see. If we can get, it to, be, <laughs> if we can get it to be less. Yeah. Than the last quote. Uh, I thought that, that just went. That was a dive bomb. I thought that went into the it, glass. It, I'm pretty sure it did. Evil oh. Knievel bug flew from the ceiling straight into a glass and then out. Good for him. Whiskey knowledge. It's not just drinking regular Coke. I don't want to. You know what I mean? Like, isn't that weird? You know what I'm can't, saying, can't David sugar, Cooper? David. I don't want sugar, David Cooper. I'd rather have whatever fucking chemical that is, you know? 
Oh, the fundraising one? Yeah, we just... Listen, there, I'm trying to get all of the fundraising stuff organized before we do any of it. We just do it all at once. So, yeah. We've um, got a couple things already lined up, but we're waiting to have everything. What's up? Hmm? Do we? Yeah, we do. Do we? Yeah, we do. Lumber should go down this year. Uh, so Jamie is... Re they're doing stamp concrete in their back. Who's Jamie? Uh friends with my wife okay that one someone paid them three hundred dollars to rip up all their old deck boards so they could flip it what yeah my so they gosh. got paid to take their deck out Jeez, oh, please. proves in the four that's from chino <sighs> i wasn't worth it chino i wasn't worth it no nope. uh, well, dr pepper Jason said that good? a per tame so it's aspartame um, I That's thought the, they stopped putting aspartame and shit, didn't little they? Little breast cancer. Don't worry about it. Thank God I don't have tits. No, you do. Guys get breast cancer. Fuck. Yeah. Well, I'll get fake ones afterwards. I'm going to have to get those things. Implants is what no, they're called. No. Damn it. <laughs> I was, was going to say where they put your tit on the thing and they squish it and they, like, x-ray it. Mammograms. Uh, yep. Yep. There we go. Little mammogram action. I'm proud of the age, you know, these days, or you're supposed to. You definitely need uh, to get your prostate checked. I've been getting my prostate checked for the last 10 years. That's just a dude in the back alley. You pay five bucks just to for your fun. booty hole. It's just for fun. <laughs> just put down new deck board. No board down on my deck. It's 14 by 70. Costs a little over two Gs. 70 is fucking That's huge. That's big. Dude. Jesus Christ. 70 inches. That's all the way across the back of his house, I bet. Is that 70 inches? No, it'd be 70 feet, Dan. No one. 14 inches. It's two feet wide. <laughs> He's like, well, we don't got a lot of money here. so It's still across two grand. <laughs> yeah, most of the zero shows are super, super low. I was Diet. like, they stopped using aspartame, I thought. It's in like Diet Coke. They use aspartame. Carbonated water. Um, yeah, this is actually aspartame. Oh, there you go. Oh, uh, it's got caffeine in it. My, yeah, caffeine, my dick. You know what I'm saying? What does it have to four grams of caffeine? I've never drank a Coke Zero. I'm like, oh, caffeinated, dude. Woo. That's because you have a problem with caffeine. Nope. Okay. Okay. Sound Grove? Nah. Oh, I'm the guy in the right. Yeah. Yeah. Barely, no, though. No, nah, he's. I just turned 21. He looks like he's four. He happens to be, give or take, 37. So he's old as shit. Still younger than Dan, though. Um, what's the most you pay for George C. Steak? First one ever, three hundred. Three hundred. Normally, like two hundred. Yeah. Getting your prostate checks. Good Friday night in Midland. Uh, Depends on who's doing it. I mean, we were talking to a doctor last Friday. Well, like a real one or like an eye one? No, no, like. <laughs> I hope Gabby's at Kleins. Oh yeah, Ryan. Okay. Yeah. And he was saying like the 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 old prostate checks are a little yeah they they're saying it he's like don't do that that's not real wait what he was like they, they've pretty much disproven the fact that they can this check is them that not way not real and he was like you just get a colonoscopy yeah this is not fucking real yeah he was, I wasn't a part of this conversation oh no no you were outside we were inside he was like yeah they've kind of disproven like checking them that way is effective. So Dudes have you, been getting their buttholes fingered for years. So you just Centuries. Get just get a cold nostril. Nope. Decades, for sure. Dudes have been getting butthole fingered <laughs> for decades for no reason now. I have not had that. The Wow. I always, I always say this very wrong. Wendy's double with cheese. Do a little Dave's double, Tim. I know it's Irish. I have Damn one. Eric. I have one of those. The Tyre O'Connell, yeah, sixteen Moscatel. Uh, I have one of the Tyre Connells at home, and I enjoy it, but I've not had that one. Don't you have to go under for a colonoscopy? Yes. Do you have to? No. I like an adventure. <laughs> yeah. No, you have to. Bitch, that's dumb. Shove a camera up my butthole. I need <laughs> oh, to be asleep okay. for it, dude. Why do I have to be asleep? How far does that thing go in there? Far. Eh, how far? <laughs> far. Ain't up farther to, than I've had. Out to your colon. The Where is that, far. dude? Far. Well, they check your colon. Oh, no, they check your prostate. prostate. Yeah, yeah, those are different. Rugged said, as an RN, I know 10 to 20 people that got an early prostate cancer by the check, and you do not want to be awake for that. 
So they must. Damn. 10 to 2. Oh, okay. They actually don't have to be knocked out for a colonoscopy. Here we go. Next video. Coming to a bourbon junkies near you. Nope. We film my colonoscopy. Yeah, nope. <laughs> Your uncle very said they want you to sleep so you don't grind on the camera. For real, how far does it go in? Are we talking like two feet? Or are we talking like eight inches? Oh, I, I think the first one. Two feet? Yeah, easily. I mean, that's you not that far. You can fit two feet in your body? Your intestines are really fucking long. You know that, right? Damn, dude. <laughs> Chick wants to feel all I'm allergic that. to anesthesia. This is my problem. No, you're not. Yes, I am. I almost fucking died like seven times. You're fine. I was in a coma. Not induced in turn intentionally. No, no, no. It was induced. <laughs> Not intentionally. They were like, you allergic to uh, anesthesia? Like, Never had it. They're like, cool, man. Then they were like, we can't wake him up. Four hours later, I woke up. So that's where we were at with that. Oh, look. A Sam Houston appeared. The proof is in the poop. There you go. That's a good tagline. We just switch it up. Oh, look. There's a 48 7. I know that people way. that were not asleep due to allergy to anesthesia, and I have seen grown men cry, just saying. <laughs> like a gentleman said. Everybody needs a nice cry from time to time. You know what I mean? Everybody needs just a nice little teardrop. Did you post your your new purchase? No. Who's Tim Robertson? Of the black on black? What are you talking about? Well, he's just talking about cars all I of a sudden. I sent it to one person, and his name's Nick. And he has a very nice GT 350. With oh, yeah, we talked about that. Yeah. yeah. Um, crying's natural. Dude, sometimes when I lift weights, I cry. <laughs> it's a good place for me to get my emotions out, apparently. I don't fucking know. <gasps> Can I tell a story? I have a good story. I would love to. You haven't heard this story nope. yet. Oh, this will be fun. Sean has the same using. Dan gets a version 101. <laughs> um, oh, you, bud. <laughs> Matt said, well, this conversation yep. just ruined my night. Me and McCullough are taking a hike over some serious Canadian whiskey channel. <laughs> That's fantastic, dude. Sorry, he was talking to me about some Shelby's. Okay, there you go. I was like, it's not black on black either, so that's the thing. Yeah. Ted, I bought a 1992 Geo Prism. Yeah. It's bright what? orange. Holy fuck. Mine was 1991. Was it? Yeah. <laughs> so me and my dad, when I was going to get my first car, before there was any decision made on what I was getting, yeah, he was like, you can look for cars if you want. So that was back when you looked for cars on eBay. You know what I mean? Like yeah. you could buy a Craigslist. whole car on eBay, yep. right? So we're looking That's around. That's what Gabby's car was off of eBay. eBay? Really? Her, she had a Montero. And that, it was off eBay. Oh, at least gasoline, like a motherfucker. That's an eBay said. purchase right there. So <laughs> it was dangerous from what I know. You could go to um, eBay and look for cars. Well, I was looking. I was like, for some reason, we had like this maroon geo prism for a little while. It was a stick shift. Oh, yeah. And I loved it. Oh, yeah. I couldn't drive yet, but I loved it because it. You even as a child, I realized you could beat the ever-living shit out of it. It made 80 horsepower. Right. It's a you natural. Break you anything. can't blow it up. No. You can redline it for literally a day and a half, and it's fine. It's something like we called ours the Skeeter because it had this <laughs> smallest little intake leak or uh, exhaust leak. So, you so it just. It. So I legitimately found <laughs> an orange one, an orange Geo Prism or uh, Geo Metro, which was the sedan version. Prism. I found an orange deal prism. I'm like, I need this. It was five grand. My dad's like, no, we're not <laughs> spending five thousand dollars on that car. There's no way. It had an, and uh, it was in Florida. He's oh. like, no, we're not driving it, across it, the country. Did it have a Confederate flag? No, no, <laughs> it was no. the General Lee. <laughs> oh, dude, I don't know why. I just thought I was like, first it car was a Shelby so GT500 cool. that have wrecked. Okay, Eric. Okay. What the? 1936 fuck? Ford Ferrari. What? Okay, how'd you? Why did you guys have these cars? Plymouth Fury. Okay. Dan, are you straight piping that GM? <laughs> okay, so let me tell you my story. So, often <laughs> these days in my life, I have a really bad impulse problem. Yeah. True. Long fuse is where I have to go with that. Oh. I'm not. You're right, but I'm just. It was a different thing. So like, I don't get like extremely angry all the time, almost ever it anymore. Beats people. And so. And I haven't been extremely angry in, like, in years. Like, I mean, like, violently angry without remorse at all. Oh, yeah. wow. Well, it got, like, I'm, we're talking You're about. You brought to a level. Right. We're talking, like, going to a very dark place. Type oh, thing. yeah. So yeah, you just did. We're at Holden's last soccer game on Saturday. Yeah. We're at the field. Soccer game's over. Soccer field's clear off. 
Holden and one kid on the team are just playing on that soccer field, which is like a little kid soccer field, at least six, yep. right? So they're playing around on the field, and Luna's like walking around, like trying to play with the two of them. About and, 10, 10 big jumps. Right, there. the whole yeah. field, yeah. So I go and I like get Luna, and I, I, I'm holding her in my arm. She's propped on my side in this arm, and we start walking away. And this kid walks up. His, this mom walks over with this child. She sits in a chair on the side of the field and just, her kid's all, probably eight years old maybe. Um, she sits down and she gets on her phone and her kid like starts playing soccer by himself. I think her thought was maybe she'll, he'll play with the Holden and the other kid that was there. But he wasn't. He kicks the ball and hits Holden. And I'm like, he didn't say sorry. Holden like looks over at me. There, he's not playing with Holden. Holden looks over at me like, what the hell? Yeah. And I look at Holden, I'm like, I have no fucking idea. Kick the kid's ball back and leave him alone fucking weirdo, <laughs> right? And mom's not paying attention. He just wanted to play. Terrible fucking parent, right? He just wanted to play. Possibly. That was his initiation. For sure don't kick a ball hard at somebody's chest. Well, I didn't know that. Right. Like, he, like, kicked it. Okay, you didn't. You said kicked it at Holden. It could have been a pass. Right. Like, hey, you want to play? I'm, we did. That is, it is. It will become very important that I express how he kicked the ball. Okay. So then I'm walking away with Luna. Details. They're on the field. I'm walking with Luna. There's a goal. Let's call it six feet behind me. I'm staring at my mom, Ricky, my dad. My family's in front of me. I'm holding Luna (laughs) right here. Out of fucking blue air, (laughs) Luna gets hit in the back of the head with a soccer ball. Perfect. Hard. All I feel is her go like this. Like that. I swear to God. Good for a year and a half. I swear to God. And I mean this with all of my heart. (laughs) I uh, I looked at her, and she looked at me, and I, I, all, I, I was like, I'm going to set her down and go to fucking prison today. <laughs> There's no other options. I've never physically been so ready to just fucking kill somebody. And I like I, how Bov is <laughs> plugging your Twitch right now. <laughs> Dude, I literally... Uh, you you so, get that like warmth come up your neck, you're just like... No, it, this was 0 to 450 Oof. in less than a second. <laughs> I literally... Okay, like through college, there were like fights Tighted. and shit. And then I had to dig deep. <laughs> so, so in college, there were like fights and shit. But oh, there yeah. was always like, I could very possibly get my ass beat here. And you didn't feel that in the soccer field, the kids' soccer field? Dude, at no moment in time did I think, I literally thought I'm going to turn around and fucking kill somebody. I don't care who it is. <laughs> I don't care if Thor the Bjornsson rock. is behind me. The Rock. I'm going to figure it out <laughs> some way. Or I'll die, right? But it was like, I'm willing to fucking die for this. How'd it work out? Okay, so I didn't realize, because it happened so fast and I was so angry, I didn't realize it was the kid who did it. What, you thought it was a mom I just, it it didn't matter. Luna got hit in the head with a soccer ball, fucking murder. Yep. Dead. Logic, little gone. If I was Thanos, I snapped immediately. There wasn't even a second thought in my head, right? So I literally am holding Luna. She looks at me, she doesn't cry like a fucking trooper. Justin Carey nailed it on the head. That's what I hope happens. <laughs> so my mom's there who's like empathetic. Oh, 100%. Especially with children. Yep. I turn around and I see it's the kid. My mind goes from anger to straight confusion because I don't know what to do with this feeling anymore. Yep. I can't punch a child. Yeah, my feeling was I'm going to hand Luna to my mom and I'm <laughs> going to beat someone's ass. And I will smother them into dirt, right? Like they will <laughs> suffocate bad, yeah. on earth. So... I'm sitting there, and I turn around, I see it's a kid, and I literally think to myself, I don't have any appropriate words for a child right now. Most of them start with F and end in up. So I stare at him, and I just turn around, and I start to walk away. I see a soccer ball on the ground, and I'm sitting here, and the kid's doing this. He goes like this. Like, oh, I fucked up. Yeah. So I'm thinking, but he didn't say anything. I'm sure he didn't know what to say. He's a fucking child, and I need to take this into consideration, but I mentally and physically could not do that. So... My mom sees my <laughs> face, and she looks at him. She goes, buddy, it's okay. She's fine. And I just start walking away, and she goes, Dan. And I go, I don't have anything to say to anybody right now. And my mom's not even a part of this. <laughs> <laughs> and now I'm mad. And so then I turn around again because the ball's right there, and I just, like, kick the ball back onto the field, and the kid's just staring at me. And I'm like, you are so lucky you're not 18 years old right now. Because even at 18, I'd consider being the fuck out of them. I swear to God. Like a gentleman, very right. <laughs> Oh, uh-huh. so then I look over that stupid fucking horrible mother is on her phone. There's a Ben a ruckus. He kicked the ball at my son. 
We let it go because I'm like, my son will I, beat the shit out of your son. I just gotta, <laughs> right? <laughs> my son is the size of a 10 year old. He'll be fucking fine. But then he did, the, he kicks it, hits my daughter. I literally see her sitting on her phone and I go, maybe she'll look up and pay attention. My mom goes, Daniel, stop it. And I go, nope. And then the mom sort of got through all this, never looks up. She's like 30 feet away. She had a good, good day. I was so, my mom looked at the kid and she goes, she's okay. It's okay. I know it was an accident. And I'm like, we got to leave. Yeah, Michael's right. Leave. We have to. Kid calls Dan a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> he walks over to his mom. That guy's a Motherfucker bitch. Motherfucker walked away, too. Oh, I would have gladly open hand slapped that kid. Now, I know it was an accident. So the, I know Do I you? shouldn't have done that. I know I shouldn't feel this way. I told Ricky, I go, what's interesting to me is I would say that's the first time in any, I, that I can remember in my head where I said, fuck it, I don't care what happens next. It's fucking hitting the fan. And then Ricky so goes, what do you think you do? that's healthy? I said, not at all. But it's somewhere inside of my body. What would you do if, like, Holden kicked it? And hit Luna? Yeah. Yelled at, oh, I'd be fucking irate out loud. Yeah. Okay. Right. My kid. Yeah. Yeah, he's going to learn that you don't <laughs> kick a ball at your sister's fucking head. When kick she's a mom. year and a half. Dude, I would have picked up the ball. I should have slammed. I should have. Haunted it. I literally Were thought. The, the, the Midland? Yeah. You could probably get the, the road from there. Oh, we are close. Yeah. We could have gotten yeah, yeah, you can through get the, the road lot, from there. For sure, oh, yeah. for sure. I know where the kids' kids' ones are. I was so <laughs> fucking mad, dude. Wow, I, was I made that so... sound so much creepier than it needed to be. I just fucking realized that. I used to ref soccer. Oh. They haven't changed that complex in twenty years, dude. I was literally. I don't know. I just never felt. I just never felt <laughs> anger like that, man. I spent five whole minutes singing "Closed Fist" or "Open Hand." Which one? Tommy D. What up, fuckers? <laughs> <laughs> Michigan man arrested for suplexing child on soccer fields. Gosh, dude, I, the, it was just such a. When I realized it was a kid, I thought, I don't know what to do now. I don't know what to do anymore. All I want to do is punch somebody, and I don't have this option. Now, unfortunately, I. So I we left, and Holden was like, "Dad, why are you mad?" Because Holden didn't see this go down, and I go, "That kid kicked the soccer ball and hit Luna in the back of the head." Swear to God, Holden is a very big fan of his little sister. Oh yeah, and loves her to death. Holden goes, the kid that was playing, like, that kicked the soccer ball at me and Zeke. I go, yeah. He goes, I'll punch him in the face. And I go, I literally, Ricky's You've in, raised yourself. Ricky's in the front seat, and she goes, Holden. I go, that's my boy. I said that <laughs> a lot. I swear to God. Robert. I swear to God. Lot. Sean, when you have a daughter, you'll change all parts of you as a human being. Hashtag Team Dan. Makes you physically violent, which is, I didn't expect it. Ricky goes, you think if Holden was a baby, that would have happened, you would have done that? I go, I would have been pissed, but I don't know that I felt... Because I never did feel that emotion. That was a very specific emotion that I felt. To murder? Yeah. I don't think I felt like that before. It was murdered a child. Not intentionally. It was more like a fit of, it's fucking over for one of us, and we're going to figure out which one. You're mad because you can't get a resolution out of it. No, I was mad because somebody hit my daughter. Yeah, I get that. That was it. And then, I was very confused about the, I don't know, yeah. I don't know what to do. Yeah. I would like to beat a child, not my child. Just beat him. I know, right? Kind of? One... One. Right? <laughs> That's allowed. Takes a community. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Come here. Just open hand. Dan, I have two dollars. Kill everyone. See, I it's weird because I never I feel protective of Holden, but <laughs> Holden I is ready to start hiding bodies. Bro, listen, that no, that's a grandless for. I should have had Holden just beat the f I would have held the kid down and Holden beat the fuck out of him. You know what I mean? I still think you go to jail for that. Even on the assist. What if I'm wearing a mask? Find me. Yeah, I, I don't think spreading corona is the issue. No, but they don't know who I am now. And then somebody yells, that's the number 9 of 20 in Midland. <laughs> <laughs> somebody said, after this rant, Dan is no longer number 9 of 20 in Midland. Uh, I would like to beat a child, Dan. Yeah. Yep. I did. Wait till a boy breaks her heart. Wait till I fucking crush him. <laughs> I, like, my, I was so angry. Luna's never leaving the house. I got it's like, super unhealthy. I got a Sean solid like about 30 17 years. years to, like, bail on that whole fucking plan. <laughs> Dude. Oh, take the kid out. Do the do the time in jail. I Dude, it's so crazy. So the dad wasn't Kill there. Him, salt the earth. The dad wasn't there. Number He's nine. Eight. It number, sounds easy, then. <laughs> number nine of Midland's Most Wanted. <laughs> oh. Holden didn't see it. Ha Dude, Holden, it would have been really interesting if Holden would have seen it because he's, like, he used to not let people hold Luna because he didn't feel like that was safe. <sighs> Gosh, man. I don't know. It made me very, very angry. Cleaning guns? Fuck no. We lift in weights. 
<laughs> I'm going to be on Anavar here pretty soon. <laughs> yeah. Ricky, so this is, Ricky made a point, which I then didn't. Then you load him, how much you weigh? And then you just load it up and curl it. <laughs> 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 Sounds great, son. <laughs> so Luna or Holden, would you have been pissed if it were you or Holden? If it was me, I wouldn't have. If, it, if I got hit, if the kid kicked me or kicked the ball and hit me in the back of the head, I would turn around and be like, what the hell? But I wouldn't have been angry, I don't think. I've been like, hey, be careful. I think I would have said, hey, be careful. If it were Holden now, I wouldn't have been as mad. See, this is what I don't know is if he was a year and a half old and I were holding on to him and that happened. <laughs> I told Ricky, I think that one of the reasons that made me so fucking angry. A lot of people are about killing children in this. Camp. I like that you guys are ride or die. For they're they're emotionally like, you guys are very okay ride or die, with you like striking that. a child. Do you want to get struck? Because this is how right. you get struck. And listen, there's at least 400 people that are going to back this up. And I like that about you guys. Screen the boyfriend. I don't need to do that. Screen the boyfriends? I will <sighs> listen. Li, 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 I, promise. I just I just shake their hands like good luck. I know that all I have such an unhealthy relationship in my head. Yeah, what I need to do. With how Ricky Ricky pissed me off the other day. Wait until you get a night rider as her boyfriend. This good I will I, I will fucking I will crush you with your Unfortunately, moped. Unfortunately, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> there's a lot of cameras <laughs> set up here. Yeah. Yeah. Good luck. When that de- when the little bell thing goes off, not so great. You, in 2006. You best fucking believe this driveway and windows have dingers on them, dude. There's no breaking in or out of this fucking place. Holy! Uh, Ricky literally goes, "You know what's gonna be funny?" And I go, "What's that?" This wasn't funny, by the way. She was lying with her preface. She, I said, "What's that?" She goes, "All of Luna is gonna think all Holden's friends are cute, and when they're in high school, oh for sure, she's gonna like." be able to date them. And I said, no, she's not. And she goes, yeah, she is. And I said, they will all be fucking, I will be an insane person when she's in high school. When? Right. We're already tracking heavily yeah. towards this. We, there? we might hit middle school healthy. You know what I mean? I, I just, you know, ride or die is a label. Oh my, but spelled as rye. That's such a good fucking, we got to do a ride pick ride just to die. use that name. Yeah. Just for the name. I don't even care if it's good. Just BJ fam, ride or die. Yeah. That'd be amazing. I think we're seeing a trend. Yeah. It's not going private. Fuck it. I wanted to slap a kid in the face. I didn't do it. I wish it was trend with apostrophe D. <laughs> trend. Uh, see, here's what my daughter thinks all her brother's friends are idiots. That's fair. <laughs> so here's my problem. Can I tell you? Okay, Brian, I'll fucking murder you, dude. I will murder you. <laughs> here's the thing. Holden won't, Luna won't be in high school. I wish I had whiskey coming out of my mouth. Luna, Woo. Luna could be in high school. Could Luna be a freshman when Holden's a senior? No. They have five years between them. Was Mandy in... Mandy wasn't in high school when Four we years. were... Yeah, she was. Well, no, she wasn't. No, because it's the same. It, it, it So it balances the I thought the you same. guys are four years apart. Sometimes. But part of the year uh, where... You don't know yeah, say yeah, yeah, yeah. So it depends me, where that... Yeah, me yeah, and Mandy sometimes. didn't line up either. So no, Holden and Luna won't. Holden and Luna won't. But Holden could be 18 in college. <laughs> Well, can we just hope that holding the pro gamer? Fuck college, man. I hated that shit. He doesn't. He's not going to like it either. He's just like me. No one, no one liked it. But I didn't even like have fun in college for the most of it. I know. I you really like, ruined my college experience. That's fair. I ruined mine too. I feel like I ruined a lot of people's. So judgy. Yeah, you were. I was, I was, yeah, I don't know. Brainwash might be the right word. <laughs> I don't know. This is, can I tell you what my problem is? I, my problem is I understand both sides. This is my problem. This is why I don't want to fuck with Luna's boyfriend. Because if I was Luna's boyfriend's dad, I'd be fucking pissed if I was fucking with my, like somebody's fucking with my son. Yeah. So Holden goes to somebody's house and the guy's got a shotgun. Me and the guy have a problem now. Do you see what I'm saying? But now I understand. Yeah, on this. But I understand the guy having the shotgun. Yeah. Because it's his daughter. Yeah, but it's you go weird, there man. and Holden's going to see his daughter and his dad's benching 350 like, what's up, son? Me and that You're guy like, just might be friends. Hey, that. We might be friends, be friends yeah. yeah. Now, but that's what I'm saying. Like, the interesting part is because I have a son and daughter, I think it's so <laughs> fucking hard, man. I'd hate college too if I wouldn't see you. Bro, <sighs> it's we had to the be opportunity fun. to have a lot of fun. Sean had a lot of fun. Yeah. I DD'd you everywhere. Yeah. One time I almost beat somebody up in an apartment for you. Wasn't my fault. His name was TJ. I don't even remember why. Wasn't my fault. I don't even remember why. I just remember he you were either. sad. I'm nobody does except <laughs> I don't even remember the reason. I just remember going there and being very angry. 
Teens walk around looking at their phones really easy to accidentally run into your elbow. Keep that in mind, Gary Fancy said. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> like, if you, we've met Gary mm-hmm. several times. <laughs> that coming from Gary is fucking amazing. That was, yeah. Gary, Gary's just like, oh, my bad, dude. What oh, did shit. we major in college? Video games. Engineering. Dan majored in IT. I majored in chemistry. Jamie, probably... Honestly. No, we definitely had fun in college. It was Jamie just probably. different than most people would think. I didn't drink until, like, basically I was actually 21. Um, I didn't swear in college. We played a lot of video games. Uh-huh. We hung out with a very small group of friends. I was, um, we had cars and motorcycles. Still and very religious and very judgy Yeah. In college. Man, I found out I was attractive in college after college. Fucked up. I swear to God. I'm not fucking with you right now. I know that sounds egotistical, you but I, I have a reason. No, though. in college I was. No, I'm not now. And let me tell you why. Okay. So one day, you know, Facebook does the thing where Facebook tells you. Low 30s, JP. Facebook tells you, um, eight years ago, this person said this. They used to do this all the time. Like your memory thing. Me and Ricky. Time hop. S- what? Time hop. Time hop. Yeah. yeah. So me and Ricky, like I'm on my phone and I'm like scrolling through my time hop shit one day. And there was a woman that I worked with who posted on my wall. And she said something. I won't say what, but she said something on my Facebook wall. Ricky goes, she wants to sleep with you. And I'm like, what? She goes, yeah, that's, like, that's clear as fucking day from that thing. She was like, oh, I miss you. When can we hang out again? But like that type of shit. Yeah. Oh, this is recently. This is like probably two years ago. Ricky and I huh? having this conversation. Yeah. So, but it's from when we were in college. Oh, yeah. The, the post is from when we were in college. Gotcha. So then, like, I swear to God, within the next month, Three of those from different people pop up. Ricky goes, I mean, she goes, you were so fucking stuck up and worried about, like, certain shit. Right? Did we drink bourbon in college? Um, and Wild Turkey 101. I used to it. drink Jack Daniels a lot. Thought it was great. I mean, it's not bad. <sighs> Edward Could Fulmer. Do uh, we drank Wild Turkey 101 once, and we thought it was gasoline. We were like, oh, my God. That might be the first time I ever had whiskey straight, honestly. Yeah, might have been in that moment. You better hope your wife's not watching. Why? Why? I say this to her face. If you sing right here, I say the same shit. Oh, for sure, Dan has no shame. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I think that she's. A, you know, think she loves me. I don't know. Nixon was president when Dan was in college. How yep. dare you, Edward Fulmer? Me and Sean literally. Well, I graduated before him because I'm smarter. But Ugh, you um, is such an easy major. It took Sean like six years, seven. Are you a doctor, or which one did you get? Associates, or? Yeah. I got my uh, associates your in seven, general studies. Your seven-year associates? Yep. Your business major, or whatever yep. they call it? No, it's just general studies. You can get a, uh, a full bachelor's in that. You know that? In general? What's That's what Tom point? Brady has. That's fair. That worked out for him, actually. He literally has a... Um, it's not even communication. I did bathe in a fucking Jaeger bed. That's true. Fucker. He did. Um, it's general studies is his degree. He did. Joe, I only slept with one, two people all through college. One of them was my wife. That was a mistake. Apparently, I didn't know. This is what we're I learning. didn't know. I never knew. Ugh. But your, your I was goddamn so. goddamn porcupine hanger. I was so. No, I didn't have that in college. Yeah, you did. Porcupine? Oh, yeah. Spiky? Yeah. No, I didn't do my hair in college. It was still long. It was long, but I didn't do long it. Long and spiky. I didn't put gel in it. No, it was just always spiky. Oh, poofy. Yeah. Yeah. A fucking Pork mess. Women loved that. The other one was shot. <laughs> there are pictures that would uh, imply Need that. Need you to believe that, yeah. Yeah. Needless to say. I was not. I was a, I was raised so fucking religious. Um, no one knows what I'm saying not to. It was not a pothead in college. I had Judgy oh, McJudgerson over here. I know. Couldn't do it. No, that's definitely not why. I drank, and he was like, no. I didn't do that. No. Uh, bullshit. I drove a lot no. of people a lot of places. It was nice. It was miserable. Dan did have a mullet. <laughs> it was miserable. I always went to, like, the parties, like, especially at James and Ricky. Uh, at least one of you dudes had frosted tips at some point. High school. No, middle school? Middle school. Uh, high school, bud. You still had your shit done freshman year. Oh, show. My mom used to make me get highlights. Yeah. Yeah. She used to do it in our house with the cap and the needle. And you pull the hair through the needle, and then you fucking highlight it. We frats? That. Hell no. What? Someone said frats? No. Or G- well, I don't know what GDI is. 
I don't know what GDI is. We're frats. Went to a bunch of frat parties, though. Well, home Treasure said, so fucking religious, t-shirts coming soon. <laughs> you and Grease. Hey, you didn't try to marry your cousin, though. Good job. I didn't try to marry my cousin. Yeah. Rich, I didn't actually say engineering. I just went to IT, and now I'm an engineer. You know? Made up title. Then I was like that in college, too? Yeah. But just, uh, your wife know you were sleeping with someone else while you were in college? They weren't at the same time, Doug. I slept with one person. We stopped sleeping together. I dated a girl. Then I went back to sleeping with said person. And then me and Ricky started hanging out. Me and Ricky hated each other in college. I stole her uh, yoga ball. She wanted her yoga ball back months later. I told yep. her she had to hang out with me to get it. Now we're married, so that seemingly worked. I feel like that might be kidnapping or something like that. Coercion. Coercion, probably. Like, yeah. um, lucky her, right? So Goddamn anyways, independent. But okay. What does that mean? GDI. Just not in a frat? Yeah. That's the other option? I guess. But yeah, then I stopped sleeping with that girl because me and Ricky started dating, and then here we are. Majoring in a science sucks. What? You know why. Yep. They have science classes for non-science majors. Hashtag chemistry. Oh, Tim, that's not something. Extortion? Yeah, a little bit. Extortion? Yeah. We didn't hate Extortion. each other like when, I, when she, like I was like, hey, let's hang out. We went to a movie. Uh, I was a gentleman, too. We talk about the time talk that we were anything. working on your bike in your yeah. parents' garage. Yep. Definitely can. You remember this conversation? Yeah. Ricky came over. Yep. Attractive we, lady. We talked a little bit. Sure. In the garage. Yep. You left, or mm -hmm. she left. You looked at me and said, I'm going to tap that. Yep. Did. Was two, right. Two kids. Yep. She knows I said that. So chat, chill out with the good thing she's not here. She literally knows about it. This is the thing. You guys think that I have secrets. She knows fucking everything. Like literally everything. My wife knows I'm too dumb <sighs> to have secrets. That's fair. That's pretty fucking fair yep yeah. <laughs> Dan Sean's pimp named Gator <laughs> um I don't know if I would have do you think being in a frat would have been fun like looking back on it no like when you were that young though no different time in life you don't think so no hmm interesting why not uh it's like know. a it's just like in my head it's like a fucking party all the time type shit yeah it would have taken me nine years to graduate. Okay, that's fair. Actually, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, fuck. Because for some other reason, I, I know it's not true because, like, even one guy that I know was in fraternity was a football player, took Calc 3 with me. Okay. Smart guy. Mm -hmm. But in my mind, I just see them as, like, dumb jocks type deal. Like, frat guys. Yeah. Right. That's how that's I see what people it. call us, yeah. Yeah. Frat boys. Frat boys. The frat boys of whiskey, too. So, so it, it could just be perception. But I don't know. I don't think it would have been fun. Okay, so that's the thing that I hear a lot is uh, Huckleberry said fraternity life was very fun. They're still my best friends. That's the thing I hear a lot is it's like you get real like a brotherhood yeah. type shit. Yeah, it's more than like normal. Um, I'm not friends with that rich. I, we haven't been Secrets in college. Secrets are exhausting. Jesus Christ. Yeah, it's too much. Ugh. And they make people really mad. It's just not fucking worth it. I just can't do it. It's just not. I can barely keep... The true straight. Ooh, I have a secret. What? But it's a gift oh, for Ricky. Fair. And I planned it way ahead of time. And yeah. it's the best gift I've ever gotten her. And I want to tell her so fucking bad. Because it's months before it takes place. And I can't, but I know I'm going to slip up. So I do have one secret that she doesn't know about. She knows there's a secret. She doesn't know what the secret is. Which means that because she already knows there's a secret, I'm for sure going to fucking tell her. Oh, for sure. Yep, unintentionally. Why'd you tell her there's a secret? I, cause I just didn't want to, I don't, because I want to fucking just say what it is. So my body's like, tell her it's a secret. You know, I get that. Yeah. It's too much anxiety. I'm shitty at keeping secrets from when I'm like, I know she, how excited she's going to be when I tell her. Yeah. So I'm like, I want to tell you. Yeah. But I can't cause it's like five Makes months, too anxious. months away or some shit. Yeah. So, um, Ricky was in a men and women's. Fraternity. It was like a business fraternity or something. Oh shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever the thing where they like you do fucking co you do like the activities where you put on events and shit. Yeah. Those fraternities they didn't seem like fun to me. I went to those events oh, and like yeah. we went to some of those parties. Yeah, boring. Fucking boring. The Halloween party wasn't that boring. That was not a fraternity thing. People went to jail that night. No, wasn't that? A Twas not there. I had to leave early. Ricky went to jail that night. I, I went that night. Okay, I wasn't that, at that one. Yeah. Oh, I was at the one not I was not the one where Ricky went to jail. The you were Hugh Hefner. Yeah, I was. That's back when I was attractive. 
Yeah, so you, wore, you wore a robe. I was 190 in those I days. went as Maybe a 200. Meyer employee because I had to you go to work that Meyer night. <laughs> you know why I was Hugh Hefner? Because that's what you found that night. At Walmart. Yep. That's all that was left. Yep. Well, Academic there was, fraternity. Yeah, well, that sounds about right. Yeah, sure. You can, yeah, yeah. <sighs> will Bell, Ricky be a person? Will this Bo Ricky? said, I was in fraternity. Many of them are super smart and have amazing jobs. Many lawyers. One is the CFO for a Fortune 500 company. All depend I could on see the fraternity that. you join. Oh, 100%. That makes sense. Okay, yeah, but would, we're talking about fraternities at Central Michigan. Uh, aim a little lower, I feel. Like a lot okay. of it lower. There are definitely successful people from Central. 100%. They might have been in fraternities. I don't disagree. So you're saying, you're telling both that that's not true. No, no, no. I'm saying like our fraternities aim a little lower. Like probably weren't that. Oh, gosh. Why are fraternities such a fucking hot topic, apparently? Jeez, OB. I'm talking about college. Murray State Racer here. Where did everyone else go? Where's Where's that at? Wherever Murray State's at. Yeah, where's that? The network you can get with frats and sorority can be extremely... I could see that. Sorority. Sorority's the girl one. You said sorority. Yeah, whatever. Sorority's the one where the girls have, like, supposedly have pajama parties. I mean... Pillow fights. Yeah. That's bullshit, by the way. We almost got snuck into a sorority one night. You almost got snuck into one? Yep. Like you were a fucking... We were in. Trojan horse type No, show? we were in. Okay. And one of the girls snitched. Wow! Yeah. Wait, how do they not know you were a dude? No, no, no. The, the girls brought us in. Right. And we were in. Right. And then one girl went past and was like, A. They're not supposed to be here? You can't be here. Why? Egg yet. Why couldn't you be there? Because it's girls only. After whatever time. How do you get snuck in with a dick yeah. when it's girls only? Because the girl said, I have a key. And we went in. Uh-huh. And then one of the girls what was like, What were you going to do? Them. Or there are several. Yes. Oh, okay. This made it sound like a bunch of dudes and one chick. No. You kind of pitched it that way? There were a group of gals that we met one night out on Main Street at a party. Okay. And then we went back. I see. It's like a group. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And then one of the girls was like, "Uh, uh, uh." That's fair. That was a, that's not. We were like, hey, Becky, not fucking cool. Bye. Tuck it. No. I'm good on that. Ladies lock up. Okay, hold on. There was a... Jamie sent something, and I wanted to read it. I hope it's not too far up here. I know it's a little ways. Oh, there it is. I like being a woman in a room full of dudes at this age more than I did in college, especially a room full of men with children. This last Friday was way better than rugby fraternity parties. Yeah. Friday was fun. We got together at Klein's, had some beverages, called Matthew Porter. It went on way too long. Uh, Sean's first encounter with a Karen. Yes. I know. Karen really ruined it. Yes. They weren't called Karen back then. Becky. Shh. What? What did Joe Sullivan say? Shenan- Shenandoa? Shenandoah? Shenandoah. Shenandoah. Sure. I don't know. I was in a huge fraternity and sorority. It's called the Air Force Greatest Service in this country <laughs> at Zachary Jones, who was a Marine. So, yep. uh <laughs> <laughs> Murray State is in Murray, oh. Kentucky, Western oh. Portion okay. Basketball School. Oh. Okay, is this a whiskey or pop stream? We'll grant my my you know what? I just thought you were being a beer. Oh. It's good. It's very good. It's the old horsey bottle. Wish I could get this off there. I just assume you quit drinking. Cold I, I I did. I had stopped because my chest hurt. Thank God, that was bothering me. That's, uh, please don't. You guys left right before the Klein, Kevin, etc. roasted the shit out of me. Apparently. Why? Why'd they do that? Did you cut them? Yeah. I feel like Jamie murdered somebody if she needed to. Need be. For sure. Need it be. looks like she knows how to dig a hole. Need be. Yeah. Need a body. Need be. You know, she, type you know, she, she got it under control. Um, we're starting in 98, finished somewhere near 2008. <laughs> yeah, Tommy, a lot of people go to school for 10 years. They're called doctors. <laughs> They're called doctors. I catch a niner in there? Pop question, you're going to get that new Fago Bomb pop soda? Never heard of it? I'm in. I didn't even know that they were doing new flavors anymore. Inevitable podcast? Uh, loose and fast. There'll probably be no sponsors. Yeah. Going to take... You know, some people... Okay. We'll eventually do one. Did you know that your mom's house podcast... 
Go ahead. Very popular. Very? Extremely popular. Yes. Highly inappropriate. Oh, yeah. McDonald's sponsored them. Did you know this? Happened what? probably two, three years ago. McDonald's sponsored their podcast because it's so big, right? Nikki D's. Their reach is so big. That podcast is legitimately it's huge. Yes. Yeah. The podcast is so big, McDonald's sponsored them. And I believe they showed a person covered in shit on that episode. Because that's a normal episode. It's tame. So they didn't, like, change the episode. Like, a person covered in shit is fucking tame. It was in a, a sewer tank. Oh, yeah. So it was in yeah. liquid An sh- actual shitter. Like, so much. Anyways, so the, it was something like that. They showed something like that. And McDonald's was, like, literally... It it came out and McDonald's like, thank we're bye, we're fucking. We out. tried. We're out. But hey, who from McDonald's? Didn't... How bad the content was. Oh, uh, that makes sense. Yeah, who from McDonald's didn't look? Somebody got fired for that. You a hundred percent. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, because they signed the contract. They hit the pay. Somebody from McDonald's got. That means they fired. paid their money for one fucking episode. Thought it'd be like a ten, at least episode. Either. I think Christina did stuff for um, where my mom's at or something like that with McDonald's, which is not. Who little tamer? That's far more about like family, sexual encounters, like normal day to day stuff, rather than shit crawlers. Pour me something. There's a guy. Uh, it was okay. a guy trying a sex toy that got the sponsorship. Okay, my bad. Mixed it up. <laughs> my bad. Dude, every now and then, there are clips that come out of that fucking show. I'm like, what in the fuck? So they do a live show, and they charge for their live shows, right? Like 20 bucks or 10 bucks or something, and then it's a live show. But the nice thing is... You get to see everything? Well, because it's a live show, there's no DMCA or anything. They can play any music they want. They can have they have guests on. They do a whole oh, yeah. show. Um, it's somewhere around there. So, I'm such Ooh. a good person. I said be nice. I know, I was. Is that the Chris Reggie bottle? Yep. Mm. Because there are two... Oh, the other one's at um, Single Malt, I think. Roa. Oh. Um, did the Sam Houston 15 replace the 14? Yes. The yes. 15's the new one. How much is the 15? 130 to 150 range, probably. Can Who's, you find it? You'll be able, it's going to be released like the 14. I don't know who Pete Jerpants is. Oh, motherfucker. <laughs> Good job, Zach. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my gosh, that was so insanely well done. <laughs> That's a good one. I'm not gonna lie. That is a good one. Sean, Sean even <laughs> highlighted the name while reading it. Like, I really don't know. Like, concentrating on trying to It's like to the fifth out. time he's fucking posted it, and I should have fucking known. <laughs> what did you think CM was? Central Michigan. Oh. oh that, was, <laughs> that made my whole night. I don't, it, like, I'm just so good now with everything that happened. Houston tonight. 15 over Cali. But. Shit. <laughs> that one hit different. It did. It did. I don't know why. Because I didn't fucking see it coming at all. I've been really good tonight on not oh, reading you have, shit. You have. And that one, like, <laughs> normally I stop, like, halfway through. Like, I'll read the first name, and then I'm like, oh, all right. I see the what you're timing was so good because it's been so relaxed. Because there's been just whatever. You could feel my soul leave my body oh, as oh. I read the second oh, half of that. I'm so happy with that. Um Jesus Cortez, the uh, Old Forcer ride would be a yeah. great one. He wants a ride. Uh, old or, Forcer yeah. ride, yeah. It's 100 proof still. Oh, yeah, that's true. Well, when you say Old Forcer 100, I, I always know. think the orange label. The, the Bullet 12 ride. That's really good if you can find five. it. If you live in the right states, apparently that's super easy. I did. I, I definitely let my guard down. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> it was, I think why it was funny is because it was so sincerely said by Sean. <laughs> like a genuine... Who's Pete? You know what I mean, dude? <laughs> Joseph Magnus Bourbon Cigar Blend. Uh, Dan likes it a lot. I, love I think it's okay. It. I think it's amazing. Um, I like the Murray. What were we talking about? Before? Oh, they're live shows. So, <laughs> Zachary Jones said that's for my table. That's fair. Um, 
So they're live shows. So they do it sponsored, paid for, blah, 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 mm-hmm. whatever. Just thinking bad about that. So you can do whatever you want. There's no rules. Yeah. They just show porn, blah, blah, blah. So they, their producer is uh, Nadav. And they have, like, this ongoing thing where, like, Tom, like, just constantly yells at Nadav and talks about how bad he is at his job. And, like, they say he's abused. Thanks, Tommy. Nadav went on, like, a three-day vacation. And Tom was like, yeah, he's been missing for a week. I don't know what he's <laughs> They're like, did you call somebody? He's like, no, why would I do that? And so he's Jewish, and they say that he's got the J anger in him. This is not my words. These are Tom Segura's words. We have, Ethan. And so um, Nadav apparently Jay. goes through all these videos so that they can put them on the live stream. Yep. I guess Tom, he said this on a different on Rogan's podcast. Because they don't go find these videos. People just send them send, yeah. to them, right, when they For find sure. them. Tom said, he goes, yeah, we sat down because Rogan's like, how do you find them? Tom's like, you know, uh, Nadav goes through all of them. We sit down, and, and he goes, we're playing the live show because we can show whatever we want on the live shows, whatever, like, show anything. And he goes, so we're sitting there, and Nadav's like, all right, so what do we want to, like, go through on the live shows? Like, usually it's, like, a topical thing, whatever we're talking about. And he goes, I was telling Nadav, like, okay, so no murder, no death, no rape, um, no, like, stuff like that. And Nadav goes, I'm going to be honest, that cuts about half of them. He watches all of them. How do you sleep at night? Bro, I like when he said that, I'm like, that's different. Shit just got wild. Like, it's one thing, like all these disgusting videos. It's a whole different thing when you're like, oh, that all half the videos I watched were all the shit you just said. So that's like what? Dude, Joey, motherfucker. Any episode with Joey on that? Joey redid his he's not doing the church or whatever anymore. He's doing like the Joey Diaz pot. I can't remember. He changed he moved to Jersey, I think, and then changed all the stuff. Nadav wrote a poem to apologize to Tom. So they... Uh, Not going to happen, Bentley. They're... Uh, <laughs> Sean's like, you, you guys are going to get Sean for a while now. Like Sean's back on his fucking... I'm re- pre-reading everything game. Yep. Um, Thanks, rugged gentlemen. Thanks for hanging out, buddy. So Nadav went to... um. Oh, fuck, what was it? He apologized to Tom for a million people. That's what made me think of it. Okay, well, Colin Murphy uh, said, y'all have to pick one MGP source bourbon for the rest of your lives. Go. Boone County. Oh, that's a good the store one. picks. Like the, like the 12, 13, 14-year ones, those are the ones. Yeah. Easily. Or Blum. Blum I, would be second to I was thinking the Nodder, but they don't, they, they don't do those anymore. They don't either. do the Boone anymore either. I'm just thinking like oh. the best one I've ever had. Is a Boone County single barrel. It's a uh, the old like pingry blue labels. Okay. All right. <sighs> Smoke wagon uncut. Uh, okay. Now are we wait? It I, it does matter. Are we going stuff that's still made? Or you like we can buy now ish? Or are we going stuff that we've ever had ever? Even though it might not still be purchasable. So I'm not fucking saying that. I literally, I knew that one off the rip. Yep. Now, the, the Pete one, I'm going to be honest, I didn't know the Pete one. <laughs> that Pete was the best shit I've ever heard in my life. Wreck my old Carter. soul. This, that's why it matters if it's, like, new or old. I'm going to be honest, that Railbird pick of old Carter is fucking amazing. Yeah, Railbird. Like, legit. Around. Um, um, that whiskey didn't destroy my soul. Maybe didn't? Tom's finally kicked it. Christina shattered her patella? Yeah, she did. She just posted on Instagram today or yesterday. Why are they so goddamn injury she prone? She broke her fibula in two places. Oh, wow. That's what happened, yeah. You can die from that. Yep. She's in a hospital bed. Yeah. In the Instagram picture. Um, what was I going to say? MGP that still exists, maybe? Yeah, which one? All time anything made. Boone County, 14 year. Single bro. God. It was yeah. the, the one that... The one, okay, I paid $375 out of pocket for it at the time. Um, good call. I, that 13-year one? I, yeah. I won it in a fireball, but the spots weren't full, so I ended up paying 375 for it years ago. And it's the best MGP I've ever had. Yeah. I mean, that's up there for sure. I got to look around. Um, I feel like that, that Blom would be good. The, M- Blom, the Bloms the- are so good, man. Man, those Pingree Blue Labels hit. Like that 13-year Cash Club one that we had. 
And I the the black labels do too, man. Honestly, like that's the thing is the all that stuff is really really good. Needle Haystack Six Street Magnus Thirteen Year Bourbon. <gasps> okay, the Magnus white yeah. labels, but when they weren't Dickel, uh, when they were MGP, those were amazing too. We only had like two, I think. And oh. They were amazing. Sorry, of what? The Joseph Magnus white label store picks when they were MGP. Oh, yeah. We had only samples of them, never like a bottle. I didn't even hate the tickle one that Bobby sent us. I did not like that one, but. Well, um, Jesus thanks, Cortez, love Jesus. the vibe, guys. New sub. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate you being here, man. There's a lot of new subs right now. So yeah. if there were new people hanging out here or there are right now, a thank lot. you guys for being one, here. One or two videos got back in the old algorithm. Yep. Uh, the nodder, they're done doing those nodders. Um, that 13 year one that we have. Whew. Yeah, that see, I think that's second place for me to the boon. Really, I think so. It so or that's like tied for second with some one A Pingry release. I just don't know which Pingry release. Because we did that blind MGP. We did a few blind MGP ones. I remember yeah, that. Yeah, the they were off barrels. camera, but like we did it when we went down for a raffle. It had I think, to be. We were I in Ann Arbor. The, or something yeah, sort, I think right? it was a raffle okay. for the the Smitty's one. I think. And I think the Nodder one. Was I think the Nodder one. We did one here that was yeah. all MGP. <clears throat> Somebody sent us four samples in the White Label Magnus one. Oh, no shit. But that was here. I think we did it on live stream or something. Napperzol. Oh, yeah. One more That's cast. What you take. That's, I don't know if it's worth it. Hey, if you haven't watched the Elmer T. Lee video, the first Elmer T. Lee video we ever made, I went back and watched that the other day because somebody sent it to me like a few months back, and I laughed my ass off. For some reason, that video is really funny. In the to me. corner of that, yeah. 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 <clears throat> Dan, drink some milk. No, need some milk. This actually isn't bad right now. Dusty Redwood Empire Batch One, hell yeah, dude. Josh, I found um, two of the pig ones, the their 40th anniversary release special oh, ones. Oh yeah, those are and fantastic. I bought them both and I put them in the bunker because you can't find them anymore. Where'd you find those? Uh, it was a long time ago. Oh, back when, like, I was gonna say we have one over there. Back when it was, we have an open one. Yeah. Back when it was Midland Liquor or whatever. Oh yeah. I found yeah. them. I just threw them in the bunker because yeah. I'm like, when I found out, I'm like, they're limited. And they don't make. They don't even make any of these anymore. MGP Rise. Mm. Keep the combo going. Uh, old all Carter, can, without a doubt. Not yeah. even close. I was gonna say all I can think of is either Old Carter or like at this point in time, Bullet Twelve. Just so crushable, man. Um. Dude, the, the the old Carter batch six, right? Five. I thought we liked five more. Okay, it's, I don't remember. It I'm was five sure or it's five. six. Okay. 50 50. Five or six was a fucking monster bottle yeah. of rye for we us. We put it on like top rise of the year. It's somewhere in there. Okay. I think we put it on our overall top 10 whiskey of the year list or something. Yeah. Um, I think it's bad. The senator, we uh, were you. I don't know if you were down at Pingree that night. Justin pulled out. I don't think so. The senator, and it's really, it is really good. <clears throat> I don't think it compares, but it is really good. Um, when is this barrel pick of the podcast going to happen? In July. It yeah. won't be out in July, but the pick is happening. I, I just, inv I just, I told them I'd ask Ryan because when me and Grease were talking about making content together, it was like I'd rather do it in person than like you send us samples, us shoot something, and then somebody edit us being separate. Yeah. That doesn't sound like fun to me. No. It'd be more fun to do in person. I feel like in, so. Thanks, Jared. I don't, I'm not going to spoil. Yeah, I'll tell Sean. I don't want to spoil what their idea is. Yeah. I like it. Okay, so fun. Jimmy, we did an Octomore blind. I think I liked eight. You one like or the eight seven. two. You oh, like I like seven. seven the most. I like the eighth the most. Eight, one or eight, two. Dude, you, you went from, first. you put like seven first and then like a 10 and 11 or something like that. I put 10. Oh, you I put the eight seven, last. Eight. And then I put only eight, like first and second. No, no, no. We, we, sure. I had eight in the second. I think about 11. La yeah. Want to bet an Octomore on it? Yeah. Oh, shit. You're that sure? Yeah. Okay. I'm back. Because um, I'm very sure that you put eight. What do we have? Eight, two? Eight, four? I think I put eight, four first. Okay. I don't think we have any twos because twos are travel exclusives. And, okay. Uh, and then I had seven first okay. and then eight. Okay. So eight, one overall. I remember that. Okay. Because I, I went back and forth between the two. Sure. And then I ended up putting seven, whatever, first, and then eight, and then 10, 11. Okay. Uh, what rye would you choose over that OC Batch 5? So n with that OC Batch 5. Kentucky I would Owl Batch 2. I would compare one of the owls. Yeah. Probably Batch 1 for me. 
I would compare Jack Daniel Single Barrel I Heritage mean, Rye or whatever you want to call good it. Good luck. Barrel Proof Rye. You're way more likely to find a Kentucky Owl than that at this point in time. But you're not you're not going to find a Wolf Carter Batch 5 Rye either, though. Yeah, that's true. You know what I mean? Like, if we're just talking, like, what are we going to compare it to? Yeah. And then I compare it to the Parker's Heritage Rye. That that's you're what I was also thinking, too, find, is but. last. Yep. I can, those four, I'd say, Oof. are all monster ryes. Yeah, we have some hitter ryes. Those right? are insane ryes, yeah. Yeah. Somebody wanted us to redo our, one of the lists that just made it. Oh, um, ryes you must have in your, ryes you need in your collection. Somebody was like, you guys should redo them because a lot of new ryes are out since we made them. Yeah. I think we made that video in that building. Really? Yeah. I think it was one of the last videos because I think the thumbnail is white walls. Yeah. So I was like, shit, it's been a minute then. We should redo it because a lot of new almost- ryes have come out since then. It's four gate worth 200. Some of it. 100%. A good chunk of it. Most um, of their stuff drinks really well. It's really, it drinks special, which is what you want. I would pay that for the, the Ruby Rye and the Calvin Cooperage. Yeah. The batch three that we just had. Robotics said, you have better luck finding two pot, the Jack Dale's Barrel for Fry. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> Ray Reed, uh, Like, I like the Rare Reed Rye. Dan doesn't okay. so much. It's all right. I think it's fine. It's spicy. I just don't think it's as... I don't think it's cool because it's not... Like, Rare Breed's so cheap and so good. And then Rare Breed Rye is more expensive and it's good. Like, <laughs> the value isn't there on Rare Breed Rye where the value on Rare Breed is insane. Like, out, out the fucking asshole. Like, it's okay. crazy. AF Madison. I can owe it. OC 5 Rye, but I don't want to crack it. It's so good. Ooh, it's is probably that one Ashley of- Madison? That's the website. Yes. That's the one. We found her. What are you thinking about? Founder. What's the callback to that? I used to think that the guy that made Angie's List, which was a work website, was Ashley Madison. Remember? Yeah. So now we found Ashley Madison. We knew that. No, but I'm saying we found Ashley Madison now, though. Because I used to tell... Um, Angie's List, yeah. But it was Ryan Angie. Yeah. That I was saying Angie's List. Yeah. I was thinking that was the one you cheat on your... We've talked the- about it like 20 times. Right, but this is the first time we've seen Ashley Madison and I reference that. <sighs> See what I'm saying? How's your site doing? Is it doing well? Or? People still use that. I think when they got outed that everybody on there was having an affair, I think it kind of tanked a bit. For sure not. In the news, like, I think it's bad press. Google it. I bet it's still there. Oh, I don't think they took it down. Yeah. It costs nothing to host a website. <laughs> yeah, I bet it's still there. People are still using it. I'm not cool. I'm not Googling. <laughs> Be like, yo, Ricky, check his history. Well, now I'm not sending free samples. <laughs> Listen, I didn't say you're a bad person. Your name reminded me of Ashley Madison. I'm sorry. My bad. <laughs> Rare Breed Rye versus Russell Single Barrel Rye. I go Rare Breed Rye. I still like it. I just don't think it's amazing for the I mean, price. We haven't had any of the new Russell Single Barrel Rye in a long time, I think. We have one. A bottle of it. We don't drink it very often. No. That's what I'm mm-hmm. saying. Like, I think your memory of Ray Reed Rye is way better than the Russells. I know, but we opened that Russells, and I bet it's still damn near full because we never drank. Like, we just don't. We, we have love one it. of the really old ones. Remember that? It's got the old label on it. That's, that's a, a bourbon. Bunch of float. No, we have a rye that's got a bunch of floaties in it. Oh, I found that at Eastman. I yeah. paid like 40 or 50 bucks. Yeah. For it. It's got a bunch of dandruff in it. Yep. Yeah. And that's what I always think of. The Russells 13, spoiler alert. It'll be on Not Monday. Not a lot of people in here. It'll be on Monday. Fantastic. It'll be on Monday. Wow. Just tell the world. 300 people. Right, but tomorrow, in, in a week when this video has 10,000 views, okay. nobody will be watching the Russell's video. Okay, so that video is coming out on Monday. Oh, shit. Which is before okay. Before that week. In a week when this video has 8,000 views. Better. Nobody will watch our other video. No, they will. Spoiler alert. In the past. I hate you. There's a reason incognito mode exists. That's true. I think one dude, oh my gosh. Josh said, I'm That's still going to watch it. Don't worry. Off. What? I think the cheaters broke up their marriages. Oh, wow. Jesus. That got dark. <sighs> Both. Um, Jason has some form of relationship with them. Like he I mean, did- he had Jackie on. Twice. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, I mean, he's on their media sample list. Yeah, he gets how- media samples from. I think he had a media sample, didn't he? Yeah. Or did he have a full bottle? No, he had a media sample. Okay. And then he, he ripped it blind with it. Oh, he came, did? Came second. What did he blind it with? Uh, Jack Daniels, single barrel, barrel proof rod. Oh, my gosh, came first. bro. Okay, so that's fair. I mean, we're on board with that. I don't know uh, what the hell. I don't know a lot of shit that beats that. The single barrel rye came second. Okay. And then I don't remember the rest of the list. Okay. 
Because I was like, ah, that's one and two. No matter right. how this turns yeah, out, that's one order. and two. Yeah. Um. <laughs> yeah, Tommy. He uh, like, what, what is that? Dreams of grandeur. That's what you got. Oh, fucking Tommy! I will tell you off stream what that's about. What's up, Curiosity Public? How's it going, buddy? Hey. Um. So when is Mellow Corn? Pikesville came dead channel? last. That's because Pikesville is literally uncomparable on that yeah. level of rye. Pikesville is like a a daily sweet light. It's still like fifty five. One ten proof. No, fifty five dollars. Yeah, for Pikesville, fifty ish. Yeah, yeah. Um, what's the deal with hay haystack? By twelve year port it's MGP. So now they're like fourteen, aren't they? They're fourteen the new ones. Now. Yeah. Mm. So the twelves are. A, about a year old, still fantastic. We haven't found one we don't like. The new ones are like 14 year, super great. <laughs> Joe Sullivan, hey Tommy, don't you have some ASMR live streams to go watch this late at night? I feel like your Twitch stream is pouring over too much right now. It is. That's not my fault. That's not my fault. Well, uh, on our last Tuesday stream, Tommy said, I'm leaving to watch ASMR stream. Yeah, I have a 14 unfinished. Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah, those are supposed to I be. I think all the 14 are unfinished, I believe. Amazing. Yeah, Tommy, this is, like, that's a Tommy thing. It's not my fault. I, don't, I haven't got, I don't, I don't know, man. You don't like, get it? Yeah. Their tits are out. Get it now? There we go. All right. Yeah, but you're supposed to listen to ASMR with your ears, like, you, you, right. Your ears, Tommy your listens eyes to are it. closed, you're relaxing, no, you're no, just no. listening. Eyes are open. Tommy's also very relaxed, if you know what I'm saying. So, um, <laughs> it's 180. Ooh. I think that's about retail. I know, it still hurt. Um, Jonathan Vingo, will you email us? Because I'm just, I'm, I'm interested. Bro, I'm in his chat all the time. Tommy also watches Once podcast a month. stuff over your content. That's true, too. Did you know this? Tommy watches Will and Crease instead of me or me and you. Bad friend. Tommy's a bad friend. Now, I love him. He's, he's, your friend, he's a mine. beautiful white beard. Yeah. It's beautiful. He was on uh Tommy, whose stream were you on the other night? Livewire or Whiskey had a live stream. He, he, Tommy uh, was on. Beautiful. He, he threw it up in the old uh, the group on Facebook. Oh, okay. And I saw it and I looked at it and said, what the fuck? Not what I, I thought. He looks so... It, it, the white looks I've so heard him talk pure. So much shit, right? And he looks like a pure happy man. Yeah, and he's jolly. And he and then he he talks to you and you're like, Santa Claus. Oh, he hates me. Yeah, but he doesn't. He's full Santa of love. Claus, biker Santa Claus looked at me and said mean words. <laughs> Tommy's the best, dude. <laughs> yeah, Tommy's Zachary like, Jones is right. You, you come by once a month for me to regift that sub, then leave. I go on, That's I so talk funny. shit, and go to use my Amazon Prime, <laughs> and people give me a sub. And then give it to James. Yeah. James just stops for me. Sorry about the sub to James. is mad at James now. What? You know James. Listen, you know James. You know how it goes. Seagrass on the early list for Rye of the Year. I don't know. <laughs> Wait, well, think about Rise of the Year so far. There have been a lot of monster rise. Now we there have been um harder rise that we haven't tried. Yeah. Those would be on that list. I don't know that old forester rye, if we ever get to drink it, would be on that list. Don't have a bottle of that, so that won't be on the list. Could be though. True. Should be. Is ninety five too much for bookers? Yes. Ugh. Ugh. What new releases should Tormentor be on the on the lookout for? Then we're gonna shut it down. Twelve thirty. Okay. Books over there, huh? My books over there. Oh, what did we? Uh, honestly, I would have said that old Forster Rye. If I'm being honest, I really wanted to try the Michigan. Did you know that Nancy blended a Michigan only batch of Magnus? Yeah, you knew. We had oh. like a brief conversation about this. I left it in my car. Um, of all the things I'm excited for this year, and I don't even remember the list right now. Stellum Rye is really good. Uh, yeah, the, the like the normal. Release that we have right. in the media sample yep. is really good. Yeah, I would buy that for sure. Yeah, both Stellums, oh, bourbon and the rye. Yeah, smoke wagon unavailable in my region due to offer a small batch for a Woodenville pick. Uh, Russell's thirteen was honestly one of the ones that was on my list this year for things I really wanted. Remember that? That's a bourbon, though. I know. Oh, that's he didn't say rye. He just said new release. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. Um, I don't know. I have like 
eight things wrote down on that list, and I can't remember a single thing right now other than that Russell's. We've not had Eora cigars. If I I, I mispronounce that, my bad. Scotch junkies. There should Eora. be a, there should be an episode this month. That's the plan. What? A Scotch junkies. Yeah. I would like to do a Scotch review here pretty soon too, like on a Monday. Oh really? Throw a Scotcher in there. Really? Just throw a little Scotcher in there. Keep people on their toes. Yeah, just get people guessing. You know, maybe it's like an available Scotch. Like a Port Charlotte, heavy peated or something. 60 bucks, available everywhere, literally. Made by the people who make Octomore. Why not? You know? Um, so, Chris, that challenge wasn't from Shayla at all. I yeah. talked to Shayla actually personally, and it wasn't from Shayla. So, um, but, yeah. I got to f- fill Sean in on a lot I think of that. One, yeah. It, I, I, I have a... Uh, Finkel, yeah, that's the, that's the email. Thanks, buddy. I have raindrops out of that flood of for information. Well, a lot of it... I messaged, like, four people today to try to get more information because I was confused. I got more information from all four. So. Uh, Dolmore Cigar Malt. Oh, it's so good. Dude. It's so I don't even care they throw color good. into that shit. It's good. You can pour that coloring in my mouth as long as that whiskey's with it. You know what I'm saying? It's I mean, so good. Just the whiskey, okay. It's so. I <laughs> yeah, but I'll mix them in my mouth if you want. They already mixed it for you. I know. They put they, it in a bottle. Skip it. Pour it. Cap. Do it. Shoot it in there, as they say. Um, all right. And on that note, I'm <clears> ending <throat> it. Love you guys. Have a good night. Hey, hey everyone thank that's still here. Support. Thank you guys so much for being here. We love you guys. We'll see you next week. We will. Or Thursday. What? For a video.